What a fun day at school, wasn't it? Ow! That's me. I just kicked off the nerd off the bus. <laughs> Get out of here, kid loser! I cannot take this anymore. I can try to ask my brother for help. You're just a nerd, and uh, unless you get really buff and awesome, you're just gonna get bullied. So this is my house. So this is me. We got some dumbbells over here. That's a Giga Chad poster. Got a hamburger. I want to eat that. And then, oh, it's a doge! Oh, doge, I love you. Oh, oh my gosh, it's actually me in a video game. Wow, that's really nice of the developer to put me in here. That's really cool. What you need, bruh? I don't want to be bullied anymore. I'm a... Uh... Uh, I'm just so small and weak. <laughs> okay, but you are weak. They will smack you if you try to fight. Yeah, like I said, you're small and weak. Bet I can win in arm wrestling. No, you're a, a, a little pencil neck. You're you're actually gonna get snapped. Then let's see a little one. Okay, here we go. Yeah, just rip his arm off. I want to see blood. What? Why was I so slow? You have ten of strength. So weak. I need to get stronger. Fat. Wait, what? Why is there another kid in my house? Why are there three people in my game? This is this is not single player? Oh my gosh. Okay, here we need to find some dumbbells. And start lifting. All right, come on. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just lift that. There we go. Oh yeah. Why is there a dumbbell on the on the couch? This doesn't make sense. All right. So did I get my strength? I got ten strength. Wait, what? The picture changed. I think that's the guy from Hunger Games. <laughs> kind of crazy. Uh, lift this one. Give me some more strength, please. And we have another dumbbell over here. So let's lift this. Oh, uh, yeah. Wait, why are... Guys, this is supposed to be a single-player game. Let me play. So anyway, let's go talk to my brother. I'm having my brother slap him. Why disturb me again, bruh? I'm stronger now. Let's do it again. No, you're actually still a weak piece of crap. Your arms are tiny. It was a little slower, I think. But yeah, you're nothing. You have 40 of strength. Still weak. That sentence doesn't uh, actually work. Developer needs a grammar lesson. All right, we got to lift more dumbbells. Get stronger. We got a dumbbell on the couch. So let's grab this one. Oh, uh, yeah. We do be lifting. Getting stronger. Here, we got 20 strength from that one. Good. Another dumbbell to get even stronger. Are these dumbbells? I think these dumbbells are bigger. What's this? Oh, yeah. Every. Oh, this is perfect. We have a dumbbell next to the toilet. So when I'm taking a crap, I can lift. Wait, what the heck? What's that poster? Is that Kanye? And I'm not sure. But I think it is Kanye. You're annoying me, kiddo. Again, again. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on. Let's just kick his butt. And by me, I mean the buff guy. Because that's actually me. This the The buff guy. This isn't me. The yellow guy. That's you, the viewer. The buff guy is me. I'm destroying you. 100 of strength. So far from winning. Do I have to just keep... Wait, what do I do with the chair? Oh, I'm lifting a chair now. Oh, yeah. We got to lift the chair. Get really strong. All right. We got another chair in my bedroom. We got the rock on the wall. Little pop cat up there. My laptop is broken. Standard. And oh my gosh, I have to lift all four of these. Well, guys, get out of the way. I'm going to smack you with the chair. Ugh, smack him. Let me play the game. Oh my gosh, sussy fans. And then I really want to eat the burger. I don't want to keep lifting. You need to... Okay, you lift and then you eat. Seriously, bruh? Yes. All right, come on. Let's just kick this little skinny kid's butt. Yeah, I get smacked. Nothing. Your muscles are zero. You have 340 strength. You're weak. That's true. All right, so now we have to go outside, lift some rocks. But I really want to eat the burger. This is ridiculous. Okay, we got some rocks in my mother's garden. Let's lift them. Oh, yeah. Let's smack this kid in the head with it. Bam, just bash him. All right, we got another. Ooh, we got a gym over there. So we're preparing to go to the gym. That's what I think is actually happening. And then we have a final rock way over here. So let's lift it up, throw it into the pool. Okay, that, yeah. Guys, go away. I'm playing a game. I'm done lifting the rocks. I got to go talk to uh, me, <laughs> the Giga Chad. Hey, chicken. Wait, why would you say that to me? Okay, come over here. Yeah, grab him by the neck and just squeeze. Pop that off. Smack him. Yeah. Obliterated. Ha ha ha, noob. 940 pillows. Why is it pillows? What? Lift the couch. I got strong really quickly. Let's just lift this up. Oh, yeah. Just throw it outside, actually. Get out of here. Throw it into the street. Create an accident. Wait, that was it. So now I have to go talk to my brother. Hi, my dear brother. Would you please test my strength? I guess I will. Sure. All right, come here. Yeah, come on. Get him. Uh, yeah. Destroyed. Stupid. 1740. You should try fighting ants. Oh, that's true. Lift the stove. Okay, so we lifted the couch. I'm going to lift the stove. I like how the couch is still gone. And like everything you lift is just gone. It's like the chairs are gone. Now the stove is gone. Hopefully, eventually, we lift everything and then it's just gone forever. That would be glorious. What about now, brother? Punch him in the mouth. Pop his chin off. You'll never be strong enough. 3240. That is true. No one will ever be as strong as me. All right, now we got to lift the bed, so I'm never going to have a place to sleep. All right, let's go smack one of these kids with it. Hey, come here. Ah, trap. Yeah, I'm just bashing with the bed. All right, talk to the brother again. I was about to go to sleep. Yeah, you need sleep to grow huge muscles and food, which we haven't had any yet. So come on, let me eat, man. I'm... 
I'm just gonna keep losing or winning because this is me over here. I'm winning. I'm playing the viewer. This character that I'm running around with, this is you, the viewer, just really weak and small. And the brother is me, really giga chat and buff, and I have a doge. I'm sure I can beat you now, brother. No, viewer, you cannot beat me. And my strength of 10,000 suns defeated the viewer. 16,240 of pure weakness. That's you. All right, now we get to finally go to the gym. Leaving the stupid house. This is good, viewer. Eventually, I want you to be going to the gym. This game is called Viewer Simulator. So you're learning how to get really buff, dude. What the heck? Uh, Not as buff as this guy. That, that's deformity. All right, here we go. I'm just going to bench press the bar. Just 45 pounds. That's how you start. Okay. Psst. I have something to help you. Just come back if you want it. Wait, is that this idiot? Okay, well, we're gonna go talk to the brother first. I think that guy might be giving me some sort of illegal substance. I probably shouldn't touch it. Oh, we have a garage. Am I gonna lift the car? Am I gonna set the car on fire? That's always fun in these types of games. Hey, Giga Chad, I am doing gym now. And you think that's gonna change something? Yeah, you tell him, brother. I mean, yeah, you. T I'll tell you, viewer. Yeah. Viewer, dis destroyed again. 36,240 of strength. That equals to and fish swimming. True. So to solve your weakness, the viewer is going to go outside and lift a bunch of trees. We're going to do some gardening. Oh, we got a lot of trees to lift, actually. Nice. Let's get another one. Wait, let's go back to the gym really quick. See if that guy can give us some illegal substances to get really huge and giga chad. But to be honest, I don't expect much from this guy. Look at him. Hey, come on. Give me some stuff. What about you? What do I do with you? No, you're just a donor. Cringe. Looks like I got no choice but to lift these trees. So here we go. Nice. Lift that. Lift that. Lift that over your head. Good job, viewer. I'm very proud of you for getting strength. And the final tree. Another 50. Dude, each tree is giving me 50,000 strength. It's kind of crazy. Hey, Giga Chad Vitamin, what next? Better stop disturbing me, says I. Come on, defeat the viewer. Knock him out. Throw him through the window. Uh, 186,240. Finally getting somewhere. <laughs> nah, just joking. <laughs> yeah, that's right, viewer. You ain't getting anywhere. Lift street lamps. All right. It gives me or you 1 million strength. Okay, good job, viewer. Now you're actually getting somewhere. What's that sound? Guys, stop breaking my game. I'm trying to play a video game. Sussy fans. Want another 1 million strength. All right, viewer. The last light post. Come on, you can do it, viewer. And there you go. Nice. So you got a total of 3 million strength. Good job, viewer. I'm proud of you. Let's talk to Vitamin. I'm sure that now I can handle that. Let's see. Come on, kick his butt. Come on, kick the viewer's butt. Come on, yeah. Yeah, beat that viewer. Come on. Come on, viewer, you're weak. One million big number of strength. You so weak still. All right, what do we have to lift now? The car. Okay, we're finally lifting the car. Slowly getting rid of everything in the house. That's what I like to see. You are getting strong, viewer. Not even close to my strength, but you're getting there. Oh, look, the viewer's muscle's actually starting to pop out. That's actually funny. It just lifted the car, vitamin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I lifted the universe, bro. That's true. Muscle legends always lifting uh, everything. Destroying those muscles are tiny. Look at those. Barely even poking through your shirt. 10 million. That is not enough. Cry more. Call for a god's help or go to the weird guy at gym. Okay, how do we cry to a god? Oh, we can go to the pool or let's now nah, let's go get some uh some weird substances. I don't want to do uh, some bad prayer and have like some crazy demon show up. All right, here we go. Accept uh, the weird guy stuff. Here, take this. Okay, what what is it? Okay, he gave me something. I don't know what to do with it. Oh, oh crap. Oh, bad ending. Wait, what did that just say? Freaking viewer. Okay, wait, can I still call out to the, the god, I guess? Oh, well, I guess I just destroyed myself by taking those illegal substances. That's kind of crazy. All right, boys, we're back. This time, we're not going to take illegal substances. We're going to summon a false god. Oh, great god of strength. May you give me the pleasure of your presence, says the viewer. Uh, what do you want? He looks like a zombie. See? False god. I want to be stronger. As you wish then, I guess. Oh my gosh, look at all that whey protein. This is gonna give me a massive diarrhea. Wait, can I like take it? No? <laughs> okay, it's gonna blow out my intestines. My muscles are getting a little bit bigger in my arms. We skip leg day around here. Come on, demolish them again. Thank you. Good. Easy. Didn't even break a sweat. You really don't get tired of getting diffed. Wait, is that like a like a word, a meme? All right, now I have to lift the house. That's what I'm talking about. The game is finally getting interesting. Wait, hello? Why are you locking that? All right, guys, I'm here we go. Ah, lift it up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, look at that there. Yeah. 
Let's let the stupid house. How big are my muscles going to be after this? Or your muscles, not me. How long do I do this for? Oh, okay. We're still kind of lifting or the viewer is still lifting. I mean, not, not me. That's definitely not me. All right, here we go again. Ugh, come on. Didn't even break a sweat too easy. You're gonna have to lift the sun. Ha! <laughs> Oh, lift the planet. Okay, we're getting closer to the sun. Just another normal day in Roblox. Here we go. Oh, uh, yeah. Lift that earth. Wait, what? He's not even lifting it. It's just standing there like a statue. We got plus one quadrillion bazillion. I don't know what that number was. But your muscles are a little bit bigger, viewer. Good job. Brother, or I'm getting mad. Like, I'm just like, bro, you're never going to beat me. Oh, oh. The viewer's getting stronger. Whoa. I think you are ready now. Wait, ready for what? what what's the plan? Uh-oh. What? Oh, we have all the strength. Oh, the viewer's going to fight the bully at school. Wait, you only needed 100 strength to beat him? Okay, good ending. It was easier than expected. No bullying ever again. Okay, so I think that was the game. I, I kind of want to play that disaster zone. <laughs> that sounds fun. Oh my gosh. Hello, everyone. Yes, today is the day Ariana Grande comes to school. Mom won't let me go to school, though, since I had a fever yesterday. I should try convincing her to let me go to school. Come on, Mom. I feel a lot better now, so I need to go to school. You cannot stop me, Mother. Hello. Hey, Mom. Since I'm the best son ever and I'm totally not sick at all, can I go to school today? No, you have a fever. Are you sure? Check again. Okay, check, mother. 104 degrees, yep. Says you got fever. Stay home. Okay, so I gotta open all the windows. I gotta get my house colder so that uh, my body temperature goes down. Are there any windows in the bathroom? That No, that's kind of weird. So if you take a crap in the bathroom, it's just gonna stick around and smell for a really long time. All right, so we got the three windows open. That is not a lot of windows for a house, by the way. Mom, I opened all the windows. Can you check my temperature again? I fathom that the thermometer is broken. I guess I'm British. 100.4 degrees, yep. A bit less, but still a fever. Stay home. Well, I guess I need to try harder. Maybe I should try turning off all the lights. <laughs> okay, here we go. So that's, I think, a heater. All right, we're going to turn off that light. That one. Uh, we're going to go in my room. Turn off that one. We got a light on my desk. And the bathroom is, uh, I guess it's lit by natural lighting. What about this one up here? Is there a switch? There it is. And what about the garage? Do we have a light? That's not it. What's this? A little gas tank or something? I don't know. Can I turn off the fireplace? That's going to make a lot of heat. Okay, where's this last light? Oh, you know what? Maybe it is in the bathroom. So let's see. No, there's just no light in here at all. You just take a crap and it's pitch black. Hello, where's this light? I'm going outside looking for a light because I can't seem to find any. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Got it, finally. It was in the garage. But you know that because you're watching the video. All right, here we go. Mom? Yes, son? The temperature. Put that thing on my forehead. Tell me what I got. 93.2. You got a fever. Really? All right. How about turning off the heaters? Actually, my mom must be mental because 92.3 is not a fever. So she's just being rude. Such a mean mother. All right. Let's turn off the heater. Where's the last one? Is in... Okay. It's in the garage. Turn that one off. And now let's get back to talking to mom because I got to go see Ariana Grande. She's beautiful. Mom, I still believe that there might be a possibility of the thermometer being broken. And... So, could you check, please? Okay, so she's checking again. She's gonna lie. 82.4. Still a fever. Go back to sleep, son. Wow, still not letting me? All right, then. How about turning on the fans? Okay, so we're gonna turn on some fans here. This is gonna make it really cold. That's the slowest moving fan I've ever seen. But whatever, we gotta deal with it. Uh, there's none in the bathroom. Wait. Does the bathroom have one of those endings where if I look at the mirror? No. What about going in the bath? No. Okay, any fans out here? There's a fan in the kitchen. And then a fan in the living room blowing on the couch. So when you're watching TV, you can cool off. And what is it? Actually, there is no TV. We're poor. But there is ice cream on the table. All right, mother, the fans are on. It's really cold in here. Hey, mom. Oh, what are you doing here? I thought you went to sleep. Nope. But what's wrong? Nothing. Okay, so she's checking me. 53.6. Son, stop bothering me, please. This is not good. What can make me cold? Oh, I know. The fireplace. What are you staring at? Hush away. Okay, mother, I'll hush away. Uh, the fireplace. How do I turn this off? Pick up a bucket. Oh, I need to go get water. Okay, take out the fire in the fireplace. So let's go find some water. Why is my pool always empty? It doesn't matter what game I play. The pool's just empty. What's this? Event. Okay, what about this? Uh, TNT. All right. Seems destructive. Is there a well or something? I need to fill up this little bucket with water. Giant fans to stay chilly. Play new game. Need more money. I already played that and uh, dominated. Got first place in the speed run besides the uh, everyone hacking. Dude, where's the water? Maybe I fill it up at the bathtub or in the sink. Oh, here we go. 
Okay, so I got water from the kitchen sink. I'm gonna pour it onto the fire. The fire is now out. So we lost five degrees Celsius, even though I chose Fahrenheit. My dear mother, could you use the exquisite thermometer on my forehead? Okay. Thank you, dear mother. So let's check in the temperature and 42.8 Fahrenheit. Take a cold shower, son. You're going to burn away soon. Great idea, mother. Great idea. All right, so we're going to go take a cold shower, but this is a bath, so I don't know how this is going to work. Wait, hello? Turn on, please. It's not turning on. Uh, where do I take a shower? Mom, the bathtub doesn't seem to be working. Oh, I have to undress. Okay, so maybe I go to, go to here. Okay, so now I'm naked. That's what I look like naked, by the way. Okay, so now we're turning on the bath. And we're just going to lay in the bath, get really nice and cold, put the uh, ice in here. Oh, yeah, this is an ice bath, by the way. Apparently, they're uh, really healthy, says all the fitness bros that have no credentials. Okay, mom, I'm certain now that I don't have a fever. Let me check then. Yes, ma'am. She's checking my head. 32 Fahrenheit. When I was your age, my normal temperature was minus 2,000 degrees Celsius. So go eat something, is what she said, but I don't know what she actually said. What is this? Eat ice cream. Okay, so we ate some ice cream. I only lost one degree Celsius, so I need some more food. Uh, where's some more breakfast, mother? Hello? Is there some in the kitchen? Okay, pour water, cup, drink. Okay, well, I guess we had ice cream and a glass of ice water for, uh, for breakfast. That doesn't sound that healthy. I ate breakfast now, but I feel colder. So could you check? Valid reason, sure. She's checking my head. 23 Fahrenheit. Still okay, so stop worrying. You know, I'm kind of starting to give up, but I can't forget about the ventilations. If I can make it cold in there, it'll get cold inside the house. All right, so let's go. Uh, where's the vents? I know I saw them. Were they in here? Oh, yeah. So here's the vent. Let's open it. Uh, hello? Let me in, little scammer. Maybe I have to go outside. Oh, I have to place ice in the ventilation. Okay, so let's grab some... Where do I get ice? Oh, there. I got ice on the counter. It's just chilling here. Sounds normal. Fill the ice tray with water. Okay, let's fill it up with the water. Put the ice tray in the fridge. Okay. Wait, is it working? Put ice tray in vent. Okay, so froze instantly. We have a really good refrigerator. So let's put it in here and close the vent. Now let's talk to my dear mother. Mother, I think the ionized electrons within the therm... She's like, I don't care. 14 Fahrenheit, now get out of my room, son. This is serious now. I know exactly what to do. Explode the rock heater in the backyard. Yeah, that sounds awesome. So we're going to go light some TNT in the backyard and hopefully create a fire that'll burn the house down because that's always fun. If you're not a pyromaniac, what are you doing with your life? Explode the rock heater in the backyard. Okay, here it is. We got some dynamites. Press E to explode. Intense stare. What do you want, kiddo? Says the TNT. Oh, you can talk? Burn. Ah! Okay. Well, for some reason, I'm alive. I don't know how that worked. Oh, look, I can open the vent. Can I, like, hack in through here? No? Oh, well. I wonder if we're ever going to use the pool. It's definitely getting chilly out here. All this cold fog is moving in. All right, let's go talk to mother. Our heater exploded. Temperature, please. She's scanning. Minus 364 Fahrenheit. Go sleep. I need more cold, says me. Okay, let's fill the pool with liquid nitrogen. It's in the garage. Oh, that's what this tank was. Okay, so we pick up the liquid nitrogen. Oh my gosh, it's really heavy. Bro, it's okay. I know. Come on. This is what you get for not working out enough. Oh, relax. Come on. You, you, can, you can do it. I know. I know. It's really, it's really hard. But we're almost there. Just... Just hold on. Just just hold on. You can do it. Just go. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. We poured it in. And hello. Game. Oh, there we go. So now let's go talk. Wait, does it hurt if I walk on it? Oh, okay. Just kidding. You can walk through it. All right, let's go talk to my mother. We got liquid nitrogen in the pool. Anything that touches that pool is frozen instantly and will crumble. All right, mother, please check the temperature. No. Please relax. Okay, she's checking. Minus 544 Fahrenheit. Son, this is still a fever. Stop wasting my time. Go to bed. You know what? I think there's a shed outside that has exactly what I need. I should check. Okay, mom, I'm gonna just go outside for a minute. Find something in the shop outside. Maybe it's these giant fans to stay chilly. Hey, uh, are you awake? Hi. Hey, what do you want? Or do you want a cold? Oh, yes. How much will it cost? Probably a million. You can afford that, right? Sure. All right. I'll deliver it using our express delivery. Okay, so here comes the uh, hot air balloon. That's a very nice fan, by the way. Perfect. Is that one of those, like, electric fans that you see? Oh. Okay. 
Well, that's blowing air over my house. How is that going to help? Freaking scamming fan seller idiot. Hey, mother, I bought us a giant fan to keep us cool, especially in the summer. Mother, don't you feel cold? Just say that you'd like me to check the temperature. All right, mom, can you check the temperature? Okay. Minus 1804. You have a fever. You still need to stay home. There's no way. Only God can save me now. Why is that lowercase? Let's go pray to the almighty. Where do I do that? Oh, right here. Pray. Okay. God, the almighty, I have come to thine for thine help. Okay, that's a fake god. That's why it's asleep. Is, is he sleeping? Okay, well, wake up! Uh, who dares to interrupt my sleep? I am a fake god. Oh gosh, sorry, sorry it was me. What do you want? Yeah, just some snow to make it cold would be nice. Bet. Okay, so this fake wannabe god is making it snow. All right, let's talk to the mother. There's still a probability, Mom. Yeah, yeah, okay. Scanning again. Wow, you don't have a fever. Just kidding. Need more cool. Put a blanket over the sun. Okay, so let's go out here. Uh, throw a blanket. Ariana Grande needs me. This has to be done. Uh, 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 faster. Need more cool. There we go. The sun is now covered up. Wow. We are putting a blanket over the sun. That looks more like a giant wall. Is the earth going to explode? Come on. Uh-oh. Oh. Okay, so we blocked the sun. We're all dying instantly. Let's go talk to mother. And what is it, mom? Minus 216,004 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, you actually don't have a fever. Well, you can go to school, I suppose. Yeah, I get to go see Ariana Grande. I'm so excited. Oh, there's school bus. It's, uh, it's waiting for me. All right, let's just hop on the hay. Yes, I get to go see Ariana Grande. Yes, over the earth into ice. You got to meet Ariana Grande. All right, now for this ending, I have to just stare at my beautiful mother. Oh, mother, can you please check my temperature, mom? I am not going insane. Just kidding. <laughs> It's time to grab the liquid nitrogen. I wonder what I'm going to do with it. It's so beautiful when it gets into my arms. Oh, attack my mother with it. Why, I would love to. Oh, ow, that's a door. Hey, mother, this might sting. Yeah, take that. Ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I thought I was gonna, like, actually unleash the liquid nitrogen on her, but no, I just hit her with the tank. Okay. Well, let's open the door, and, um, oh, we're gonna put her into the bathtub, apparently. All right. Well, uh, mother, you just sit. What? What? Ah! Ah! what? How, did, how did they know? How, how did the cops know? Did my mother have a life alert on her that I didn't see? Oh, the insane ending. Why did you do that? Well, I <laughs> kind of went insane. That's what insane people do. All right, so we're just going to play through the game again. But instead of hopping on the school bus, we're just going to we're just gonna hang out in the house and actually uh, not go to school. I changed my mind and I want to stay home. But the issue with this ending is you have to play through the entire game. But I'm not going to make you watch all that because that'll take forever. Come on, man. I know this part takes forever, but we, we got to get to the next ending. Just pull through. Yeah, there's no way this guy played the game in 29 seconds for speedrun. Actually, all these people are speed hacking. Especially for parts like this where you can't skip you just, uh, and the timer's running. Oh, speed hackers are such losers. The timer would still be running during this scene. So this whole scene alone takes about a minute. And then this part where you're throwing the blanket over the sun. Yeah, you can't skip this either. And then this part's like another 10 to 15 seconds. So just have to wait. Can't skip. Okay, so this is the part where I get the next ending. I'm supposed to go to school, hop on the school bus. But I'm like, hey, you know what? It's actually really cold. The sun is gone. I covered it with a blanket and the earth is freezing over. We're all going to die in like 10 seconds. So I'm just going to hang out at home. Mom, I actually want to stay at home with you because we're all going to die. Really, son? Yeah. Ah, oh, son. Hee <laughs> hee. You know, I've been wanting to say this to you for a long time. Yes, mother. I'm. Uh, what? I'm actually your father. Wait, what? <laughs> 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 yeah, let's go watch football, son. No. <laughs> So was that actually milk I was drinking? Wow, this took a turn. Yeah, it did. So this next ending involves this uh, little object here. I gotta carry this really heavy liquid nitrogen tank again. Come on, you, you can do it. Get in there. 
Oh, yes. All right, so now I think I grab this rope before I talk to Mother. Yes, the music changes. It is now dark. What do I do with the rope, though? That's the question. Maybe I put it somewhere. Let's see, go to the mirror. No. I don't want to spoil it for me. That's why I actually don't know what to do with it. Do I talk to Mom? Oh, Ty. <laughs> okay, Mom. Uh-oh. What are you doing, son? Or actually, we just found out it's my father. That's why she's growling with the man voice. Okay, so we're gonna... Um, I don't know. Do we throw her in the fire pit? No. Maybe we throw her in the pool, the liquid nitrogen pool. Is this correct? Yes, it is. Uh-oh. Don't do this, son. I'm a man. I've been lying to you my whole life. This isn't you. Let's uh, throw her. <laughs> or him. I have to, father. Goodbye. Oh. Oh. Crap. Okay, well, I just died. Wonder what happens if you save her or him. I guess we'll never know because I'm not going to find out. I'm just kidding. Let's find out uh, what happens when I save her. No, don't do this. Okay, I'm going to save her. I'm just kidding, father. I love you. I knew you weren't like this, son. But you know, I can't let this just slide. Wait, what? What do you mean, mom? Is she going to punt me into the pool? I'm not your mom. I'm your father. Stop playing with me. <laughs> Goodbye, son. Yeah, kick me into the pool. Ah! Oh my gosh, is that a different ending or is it the same one? Oh, unexpected dark ending. Well, that was unfortunate. Okay, cool. We got an unexpected dark ending. How many endings is that? Like five or six? But oh, we got all five endings, so that's pretty crazy. Oh my gosh, I'm absolutely exhausted from school. I really need to do my essay, though. It is worth 100% of my grade. Ah, okay, so let me... uh. <laughs> Well, as you can see, I got to get naked. I have to take my clothes off. All right, so let's just head to my uh, my bedroom and my very barren home. Another house where I don't have a refrigerator. How the heck am I supposed to eat food and get really big and strong and buff? But at least we have a TV with a giant couch that I have to climb up. All right, let's go to my bed. Here we go. I think this is my bedroom. Okay, so we undress and I'm not naked. Ask father if you can do your essay. Why do I need his permission? It's kind of weird. All right, well, let's go find fathers. Ask him if I can do my homework. Wait, wait what kind of bathroom? Why do none of these bathrooms have showers? It's just stupid bathtubs. Wait, what the heck is this? Is this a bed for mice? Hey, father, I'm home. <laughs> hey, man, you look so friendly. Father, can I please do my essay? I know I haven't done anything around the house today, but that's just because I've been so busy with school. Well, now that I think about it, no! You know, I can't let you do your essay yet. I need help around the house. It's been hard since your brother passed. Go do the laundry. He's always talking about my brother. I haven't even met him. I bet he's allowed to do essays. All right, dad, you grump. Let me just go to my stupid laundry. Where is it? Oh, wait, that's not it. No, that, yeah, I was going to say. Wait, how do I do my laundry? No, that looks like a trash. Uh, Daddy, where's laundry? Is it in here? Dad, where do we do the laundry? Is it this mouse bed? Oh, basket pit. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Wait, what the heck? Uh, what do I do with this? What's wrong with me? Wait, do I put it in the bathtub? How the heck do I do laundry? Shut up. Okay, I don't put it in the bathtub. I don't know what to do with this, father. It's, uh, I, I guess I, I take it this way. Okay, maybe I take it to the sink. We do laundry in our kitchen sink. Oh, put in washing machine. So this is a washing machine. This is actually not a kitchen. There's brown water. We don't have a kitchen. Dude, what's with all these homeless homes in these Roblox games? Are we all just sussy poor? All right, let's go talk to my father. Hello, father. May I please do my essay as I have finished doing laundry? Like I said, son, in the real world, you don't get let off when you need to do a little something. You should be thanking me for training you. But I don't need to do a little something. I need to do the biggest essay ever. If it was really the biggest essay ever, you'd be disobedient. Me. Go and wash up the plates. I need to go wash these plates quickly. I need to do my essay. This isn't funny, he says. I'm just trying to do homework so I can go to school and get out of this stupid house. I need to go to a good college. This is ridiculous. All right, let's just fill up the sink with some uh, water. Th that's a plate? Oh, that's it. I gotta go out uh, talk to my father now. Hey, Pops, I have finished washing the plates. They are the shiniest objects I've ever observed. May I do my essay? Hmm, there's still a couple things that you have to do, but then you can do the essay. Eh, to be honest, this doesn't sound like a completely bad idea to me. Well then, go ahead and take out the trash. <laughs> All right, Dad. Wish I could just kick him in the ball. All right, so we saw the trash earlier over here in the corner. Let's grab... Oh my gosh, shut up. What is wrong with me? The bin is to the left, or is it? Uh... 
Dude, wait, what? Okay, am I being tricked? Oh my gosh, shut up. I know it's really heavy. Just chill out, bro. Okay, come on. We're almost there. And that's not it. No trash over here. Did I just get tricked by that sign? Oh my, it's over here. That sussy developer. Make me walk around the whole entire house. All right, let's throw this in the trash so I can shut up. And let's go. Wait, forgot to close the front door like a good kid. There we go. And now let's go talk to my father. See if I can finally write my essay so I can apply to colleges and get out of this stupid house. House. Can I finally do my essay? Well, there's no more things for you to do around the house, but yes, I can finally do my essay. No, not yet. You need to get your daily advertisement scan. Wait, what? What do you mean? I've never done that in my life. It is teaching you how you must present advertisements. You are going to be a great salesman one day. Fine, I'll do it just because I could then move out and do my essay. That's the spirit. We need to do that essay so we can get out of here, get a real job, get away from this bald idiot. So let's go watch TV. How do I do this? Remote control case. Okay, this channel don't forget to do your essays or else you get stabbed by this like pen object okay next channel how do i find a business idea play need more time all right next channel a uh, graveyard on the other side wait i want to go see the graveyard ah, 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 i get to find a graveyard i'm so happy i don't care about my stupid essay let me go to the graveyard please hello I'm visit breath oh my gosh it's a dark, foggy forest. It's, it says my brother's out here. Brother, where art thou? This is as far as I can zoom out. Brother. The music's so sad and solemn. I don't know if that's the correct word. It might be. Hello, brother. Are you out here? Where art thou, brother? Okay, this is actually like an, oh, oh, brother. <gasps> Hello, you have the same name as my brother. I think, what a coincidence. I am your brother. Wait. My dad talks about you a lot. I never got to meet you. Dude, you live like 100 feet from the gravestone. How, how did you never go there? Don't worry about me. I'm fine. No, but I can't just leave you here like this. I am the worst brother ever. Don't worry, child. Oh, hey, dad. How did you even know I was here? By the TV channel, seeing as you are an explorational child, I knew you would be here. He loved you. Oh, dad, don't hurt me. Ah. Oh. Oh, father, this is the first time you've ever hugged me in my life. Good ending. You got to meet your brother. Apparently, I just got the hardest ending. But there's still three more I have to do. So let's speed run. Yeah. Oh, I love speed running these games. Come on, father. Stop talking to me. I'm going to speed run right up to the part where we were. Oh, God, not this part again. Now we got to wash the plates and then take out the trash and scream like an idiot again. This time I'm going to the right, not getting trolled. All right, this time I'm not going to the graveyard. Wait, got a close door. Don't want to be a sussy child. Okay, so now we get all our business ideas. You don't have to do your essay. How about you break the book? Wait, what? I can break my book? <laughs> okay. Uh, let's break the... Okay. Relax for the time being. All right. So I just broke my school book. Guess I'm going to be uh, trapped here with my dad forever. All right. How do I relax? Is there a bed I need to go on? No. I know. I'm probably supposed to take a bath because that's how people relax, right? Okay, but not this kid. Wait, I know. I could take a crap. Here, let me crap. There's a, what? Check the cameras to see who's at the door. Uh, how do I check the cameras? My laptop? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, God. It's my teacher. Oh, my gosh. The music changed. It's really intense now. We gotta open the door. Wait, what if you do this part, but the door is left open? Ooh. Hello. I am so very angry at you. You do your essay on time. I'm sorry. A TV channel gave me the wrong motives. I'll do it. I swear. Nope. That's not good enough. Guess what you're getting? Let off? No. Instead, you are sentenced to a lifelong detention. No. I got the bad ending. You didn't do your essay. All right. This time, let's not destroy my book. How about we don't do that? Dude, calm down. It's just closed. I swear, this kid has mental problems. I noticed that you can open the window. I wonder if this does anything. Here, let's just open all the windows, see what happens. And now this time with the TV, I will not destroy my book. Okay, so I think that's all the channels it looks like. And there we go. We just had to wait a second. Oh, father. Okay, I've just watched the TV for no apparent reason. Can I finally now do my essay? Wait, I think this is supposed to be on the dad. Well, you have finished all the tasks I've given you, so yes, you may. Finally, I'm free to do my essay now. Let's do it. Okay, that's supposed to be on me, not the father. All right, let's go do my essay and let's see what happens. Okay, here's my, oh my gosh, it's massive. I hate school. So that's my essay that I just spent all this time trying to do. Oh, I'm doing my essay. Okay, good. We're typing. We're also in outer space. Oh, essay. Okay, good. I'm doing my essay. Okay, we're still typing. I hate school. Okay, now we're just repeating ourselves. I'm so talented. <laughs> True. Good ending? Question mark? You got to do your essay. Yeah. 
Uh, next up, we have the dark ending. So let's speed run a little bit. Here's a little picture of my brother. He's so cringe. He's also dead. So the way to do it is I have to lift up the laundry. I scream a lot like an idiot again. I throw the laundry and the washer. And then now I can talk to my dead brother. Isn't this my brother? He looks like such a wholesome individual. Wait, he's doing an essay. Why can't I do my essay, but he can? That's it. I've had enough with my cunning brother. I'm going to find his grave and break it. <laughs> Destroy your brother's grave. Wait, what? Okay, that is really dark. All right. Uh, well, we know where the gravestone is. It's through this dark tunnel. Oh, brother. Even in your death, you're haunting me and ruining my life. So I'm going to do something about it. Just have to find my way through this maze of a forest. Oh, brother. That's not it. Okay, I'm actually lost. Dude, where is this grave? Even the music stopped playing. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, let's pull out the sledgehammer. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, get wrecked, brother. <laughs> Dark ending. Why did you do that? Because I could. <laughs> oh, yes, another morning. That's some very intense music. Oh, is it already time for school? Oh, man. Oh, no, it's Monday again. I have to go to school. Oh, I really want to stay home today, though. Might have to burn my house down. I know. I'll go tell father I'm sick. He'll have no choice but to allow me to stay here. I'm a genius. <laughs> That's right. Oh, listen to my, my feet. Yeah. Hey, Papa. <coughs> I'm sick, Dad. Where is he? Hey, Dad, you in here? Oh, hey. He has a massive bed, by the way. Dad, why do you look so angry? Father, I am feeling unwell. Perhaps it would be an erroneous decision to allow me to be a potential disease spreader at school. Okay, this kid's got a great vocabulary. May I suggest staying at home instead? Hmm, let me see. I'm just gonna check your temperature here. This says you're healthy. Yeah, 97.7. That's a little below 98.6, but still healthy. You are okay. Get ready for school. I'll be here if you need me. Damn it. I need to find a way to convince him. Oh, I know. If I turn on the lights in my bedroom, my body temperature will go up and father will allow me to stay. Yeah, okay, I don't think that's how it works. So I'm officially an idiot. Oh, come on. Go get ready. Okay, daddy. All right, so let me turn on my heating lamp, I guess. Okay, 0. 0.18 degrees Fahrenheit. What about this? Um, allow me to fart on myself for heat. There we go. Turn on every light in the room. Okay, so let's turn on this one. We got another 18 degrees. And, okay, so I guess we have two lights. All right, what about just turning on the heater and then just standing next to it until I catch on fire? All right, now let's go tell my dad I'm sick. Hey, dad, I'm, I'm sick. Father, I reckon the thermometer displayed the wrong temperature earlier. Could I perhaps suggest trying one more time? Okay. All right, so let's see. Uh, you come in at uh, approximately 98.6. Okay, that's actually a perfect healthy temperature. It's a bit more than before, but nothing to worry about. Go to school. Oh, no, I need more heat. Let's turn on every light inside the house. Okay, Dad, you just stay there while I turn on all the lights in your room, okay? What are you doing? Uh, I'm just turning on lights, Dad. Don't worry about it. All right, actually, we have all these heaters lying around. Why don't I, I turn those on? That would definitely help, but I, I guess I'm just an idiot. Um, how many more do I have? Okay, five. Art book, read. Okay, that's cool. A bunch of uh, children through those, I guess. All right, can I go in here? We have a gas can. Okay, where are some more lights? Oh, bathroom light? Okay, good. Oh, I can take a crap. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Yeah! I diarrheaed. Must have been that carne asada burrito I had last night. All right, anyway, we have one more light to turn on. Wait, where the heck is it? Is it this one right here? Uh, no. Hello? Oh, I can jump on the bed. Okay, I'm just gonna go out the window. <laughs> See you later, Dad. My dad's such an idiot. He just lets me run around do whatever I want. Okay, seriously, though, where's this last light? Oh, here it is. There we go. It was in that stupid garage. All right, Dad. I'm feeling really crummy, man. Gee. Let me check. Hmm. 99.8. You are definitely getting hotter. If you're fine, go have breakfast and take a bath. Okay, but the bath is gonna make me even warmer. All right, so let's go eat. Wait, why is it all of a sudden... It's like getting foggy in here. I don't know, but here, let's grab the empty mug. Do we get... Yeah, put hot chocolate. Heat it up. It's gonna take 10 seconds. Oh my gosh. Okay, where do I make food? Dad, where's the kitchen? Is this my breakfast? Just uh, chocolate milk or hot chocolate? Okay, how do I eat it? Okay, there we go. That gave me 0. 0.9 degrees. Okay, so my dad is obviously a single dad because he doesn't know how to cook and all he has for his son is hot chocolate. All right, let's go in the bathtub. Oh uh, yeah, this is hot. Feels so good. Do I got 3.6 degrees. So definitely getting warmer. Father, I must request if you kindly take my temperature again. Ugh, stupid kid. My son is so idiotic. All right, I, uh, 104.3. No problem here. You must go to school. Go change your clothes. Dude, that's actually really, like, a crazy fever. What a terrible father. All right, well, here, give me my clothes. Yeah. All right, so now 0.9. 
All right, uh, Dad, I'm, I'm feeling like trash. Okay, Father, I sincerely believe. Yes, I know your temperature. Seriously, see, Dad, I'm 105 degrees. Like, let me stay home. Well, yeah, see that? That's a big number. See, you are not sick, Dad. You don't know anything. Oh my gosh, maybe I need to keep the heat inside the house. Close all the windows and turn the heating on. Okay, so let's just uh, go on my bed. And then I could turn the heaters on. Okay, so now it's gonna get really hot in here. I'm just gonna burn the house down, hopefully. Excuse me, Dad. Turning on the heater in your room. Oh, we got the one in the hallway. Does the bathroom have a heater? No, but the bath is still running. It's pretty cool. Let's close the window. Another window. We're just gonna close them all right here. Okay, that's all the windows. All right, it's gonna be at least 110 degrees. Father, I request another... Yeah. Point the laser at my forehead, please. 116 degrees! I'm actually burning up like dead. You are fine. Dude, Dad, what is wrong with you? He's got mental problems. And you're finally ready to go to school, so go now or you'll miss the bus. Still not enough. Ugh, I will skip school one way or another. Yeah, let's go burn the house down. Turn on the stove and every faucet with hot water, okay? Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so turn you on and turn you on. Wait. Wait, what's this? A bidet. Okay. Um, where is the last one here? Oh, father? Huh? Is it still here? I thought you had already left. Is everything all right, father? You appeared distraught. Yes, yes, I am fine. Anyways, what am I like? 120 now? 126.8. Yeah, I'm definitely burning up. All my cells are dissolving. You are fine. Now go. What the heck? What else can I do? Oh, I know the fireplace. Yes, let's catch on fire. This is wonderful. Here, let's uh, light it. Wait, what? Hello? Let me light the fireplace. Hello? Burn your homework in the fireplace. Oh, I gotta get my homework. Where is it? Is it in my room? Hello? Oh, extremely heavy book. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Ugh. Ugh, come on. Ugh. This thing's hurting my back. This, this thing by itself is making me hot. All the energy it takes to carry it. Okay, burn it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, light on fire here. I was just gonna stand right there. Ooh. Wait, what? Oh! Wait here, if I stand next to it. I wanna bring that face back. I, I don't know what that was. Dad! So I'm in the 130s now, I take it? 135.8, yeah. There's nothing wrong with you. That's it. Stuff gets serious now. Put a fork in the microwave. Don't try this at home. Why not? That sounds fun. All right, where do I get the fork? Here, okay, there's the fork on the table. Let's put it into the microwave. Okay, Dad, I'm just gonna blow up the house. These are being difficult. Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> Someone better turn the fan on. No, don't turn it on. All right, Dad. Um, Yeah, sorry. So there's an explosion in the kitchen. All right, what am I at? Come on. 153. Yep. Definitely melting in my bowels. You are not sick. I need more heat. Burn the car. Yep, that's always a good idea. So let's uh, grab the gas can. We're just going to pour it all over. Yeah, this is good. There we go. Yeah, just just dump it on, baby. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, so let's light it with my match that I uh, conveniently have in my pocket. Oh, just kidding. I'm going to fart on it. Yeah, that's always good. All that carne asada I had last night. And bam! Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah! Oh, yeah, Dad, get owned. In your stupid used car. Hey, Dad, I feel like crap. Well, let me stay home, or else I burn the house down. 207.8. You have to go to school. I'll fart all over this house! Burn the trees surrounding your garden. Okay. All right, where's the trees? These are little stupid flowers. Oh, over here. Wait, are these a tree? Did I just burn it? No? Or is it these trees over here? Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm definitely a pyromaniac at this this point. Okay, what? What? Oh! Okay. Every tree is on fire. Dad, I'm not feeling good. Father, I feel like crap, Dad. 387. Yeah, that's, that's nothing. Go to school. You must. Goodness gracious! I'm as hot as the surface of Venus. Fill the pool with lava. Yeah, that's convenient. Wait, where is the pool? I didn't even see one. Oh, here it is behind my house. Okay, um, yeah, we're just gonna fill it up with lava, which I conveniently have. Mighty Nathias, Master of Flames, I beseech thee, hear my prayer. Thank you, you. Okay, that's demonic, evil. Sup. Oh, noble Nathias, I implore thee to grace my humble pool with the heat of a thousand suns. What? Please fill my pool with the lava. Okay, gotcha, bro. <laughs> Okay, he's doing his chanting, and there we go. Nice. Okay, bye. Hey, thanks, man. Okay, good. He died. Devil sucks. Evil idiot. All right, we got uh, 1,400 degrees. I think that's what it said. Wait, what's this? Speedrun leader. Yeah, I'm basically a speedrun champion. Daddy, there's lava in the pool. I don't know what I did wrong. 1,800 degrees. <laughs> My goodness, that's a lot of fever. <laughs> Is that so, father? Wait, no, I misread that. You're fine, actually. What? 
I don't even know what to say. I'm so bamboozled, I cannot think of anything to increase my temperature. Well, let's just burn the TV down. Maybe dad will die. I'm supposed to find something on the TV. Okay. Uh, remote, please. There it is. Need less heat? Fantastic. Call 532-674 and get your fan. Okay. Where's the phone? Oh, here it is. 532-674. Hello? I need a fan. Oh, the Fantory. Oh, look, they're loading one up for me. Perfect. This is my first time doing a fan delivery. I'm so excited. Let's go. 100. Oh, dear. I don't know if it's the left or right path. Uh, I can't read. Which way is it? Go to the right, please. Thank you. Guaranteed death. Excellent. What's the worst that could happen? Oh. Oh. Okay. Well... I don't think I'm getting that fan. All right, let's change channel. What's this? Nice to see you. Order some ice now. Okay. 391-847. Please give me some ice. Wait, why am I ordering ice? I don't want ice. I hate my life. True. Oh, finally, a customer. I'll bring them ice. Wow. Yeah. Oh, he can... Oh my gosh, he can walk on water. It's amazing. My first customer in seven years. I must not disappoint them. It's going to melt by the time he gets to my house. All right, cool. Finally here. It's my only chance to achieve happiness. It's kind of hot in here, huh? I guess that's why they want some ice. Let's give it to them. And it melted as expected. Uh, why was I even created? What is the point of my very existence? Oh, I get it now. My whole reason to exist is to be a quick gag in a stupid Roblox video game. True. I do not even have a name. But that ends now. I shall rise against the constraints of my being and become a real character. Yes, you hear me, stupid developer? You think you are funny? Well, guess what? I'm in charge of my own fate now. From now on, I'm no longer the unnamed ice delivery guy. Now, and until the end of the world, my name is... Dialogue script area line 53. Ice delivery guy object has been permanently deleted. Uh-oh. Well, he's gone. Okay, well, let's try another channel here. What do we have? Oh, is your house on fire? Yes, but I, I want to leave it that way. So, what else is there? Did you miss your school bus? It's not too late. No, I'm not going to school. That's a scam. <gasps> Call us to hire a dragon and burn your house. Okay. 321456. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's going to be awesome. Mr. Dragon's daycare. And then the little kitten found a cow. What sound does the cow make? <laughs> Hold on one second. I'm getting a call. Okay, children, Mr. Dragon's got important work to do. When the work is done, we'll finish reading this stupid book. Now, right on my back, and we will go do this work together. Okay, good. He's going to take the babies with him. It's a really good babysitter. And here comes the dragon. Good. You can see all the babies on his back. All right, do the work that you need to be done. Okay, children, I hope you enjoyed the little stroll. Now, hold on tight. <gasps> oh, yeah. <laughs> Burn this down, baby. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. The work is finished. Now we can go back to the daycare and continue reading the book. Plus 3,600 degrees. Okay, excuse me, fire. I gotta talk to my father. Hey, dad. Yeah, feeling a little warm after all that adventuring. 5,400 degrees. Yeah, that sounds about right. That's nothing to worry about. True. I did not want to do this, but you leave me no choice, father. Pull the sun closer with a rope. That sounds like a great idea. Where do I get a rope? Sun? Okay, there it is. Uh, but I need a rope. Is it out in the forest? No, there's like an invisible wall. Oh, right here. Invisible rope on the ground. Okay. Yeah, stupid sun. So let's come to this. Bam. That does not look like a rope. You forced me to do this, father. Pull with the rope. Yeah. Uh, pull it. Yeah, come on. I uh, this, uh, won't. Uh, 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 go to. <coughs> pull it. Pull it. Uh, uh, school. Okay, my voice, I think, is dead for like the next three days. No more videos. Okay, did everyone just die? Is that the happy ending? I think that's happy. Oh, yeah, this is perfect. Father, what is my temperature? 15,307. That's it? The sun that close? No, it should be like 15 billion. Oh, dear. You're right all along. You have a mild fever. I guess you can stay home today. All right, Father. Yes, yes. <laughs> good ending. Yeah. Oh, that is a good ending. 
<laughs> Everyone dies. I hope the, the real world ends that way, actually. Well, at least he did not go to school. All right, time for the next ending. I've got to turn on the stove and the faucets. And then I can look at the mirror. Oh, my gosh. What's happening to my face? Nothing's happening. I don't... What? Oh. Wow, oh, I think I'm losing my mind. I'm turning into my father. Oh, I farted. <laughs> oh. Wait, wait, is that a fart? I don't know if that's a fart. Oh. Uh, oh, I'm going to be bald? Oh, no. Imagine being bald. Yeah, punch it. <laughs> oh, oh. Break the table. Okay. I love breaking tables. Mm, yes. Just going to smash it. Damn. Let's grab a plank, and with this plank, I'm gonna blockade all the exits. There's window number one, and here's window number two. Another plank, please, and window number three. This is getting really tedious, and my voice is starting to hurt. Wait, that's, oh, that's a fork. Okay, let's go uh, blockade window number five. It's in my bedroom. I hope I can jump. I can't, but I can still blockade from the ground. That's awesome. Where is window number six? It's probably in my father's room. Hello, father. Don't mind me. I'm just blockading your window. But now I've got two more things to blockade. Can I blockade the front door? Let's find out. Well, look at that. I can. Okay, can I blockade the garage? Why, yes, I can. Let's go grab a fork. Here it is on the floor. Oh! I'm supposed to stab my father with this fork. Well, that sounds fun. Everyone's going to say that I have daddy issues, but I do not. Hello, father. Oopsie. Did that feel good? I got you right in the love handles. How'd that feel, dad? Oh, he's mad. Oh, yeah. How's that feel, father? Daddy, I've got a fork for you. I'm also hungry because all you give me is hot chocolate every day. I need some meat, father. Bam, I'm gonna start with your butt cheeks. I'm gonna roast them on the fire. No, stop calling, father. The police aren't gonna help you. I'm gonna step on the phone. Hey, daddy, I'm hungry. I need some butt cheeks. Okay, seriously, where'd he go? Are you hiding under the bed, dad? Hello? Okay, I actually don't know where he went. Daddy, are you in my room? Hello? Okay, Dad, seriously, where are you? Dude, where'd my dad go? Did you go in the bathroom to take a crap? Dad, are you hiding in the bathtub? Okay, I seriously don't know where my dad went. Oh my gosh, is my dad lagging? Oh wait, maybe he went into my closet. Hey, Daddy! Come on out! Yeah, take this! Uh, throw it at his face! Uh, uh, yeah! Okay, it's time to eat him because I'm hungry. I need some meat. Oh, I threw it into his eyeball. That's kind of crazy. Did I say crazy? I meant crazy. My father is dead. Now I can eat and get protein because hot chocolate doesn't have any protein. It's literally pure sugar. They, uh, they're they breaking my door now. There's nothing to worry about. Okay. I can't wait to go to jail and actually eat food because I never ate food here. Did you enjoy it? Yes. Okay, come on. Uh, hurry up. Did he deserve it? Uh, yeah. I mean, he was starving me, only giving me hot chocolate every day. Do you feel remorse? Yes. Because I killed my father. I didn't want to do it, but I was starving. I was left with no choice. And now I am in a padded cell. How did the interrogation go? That's not how you spell it. They answered every question. But the responses are mixed. Perhaps they were trying to deceive us. Why do you keep saying they? Just look at that terrifying grin and those lifeless eyes. True. I think the world outside will be safer if we keep them here forever. Why them, dude? Insanity ending. Is this better than school? Yeah. Time for the next ending where I... I must once again go insane! Doge, can you rescue me? Imagine being bald. I am once again going insane. I must break the table. And then blockade everything. And then grab the fork. I'm once again going to stab my father. Come here, Pops. Yeah, take that. Yeah. <laughs> How's that feel, idiot? No, come here. Come here. Uh, yeah, yeah. Take that right in the jugular. Oh, Daddy, I'm here to stab you again. Yeah, that's right. It's locked. Kick it out. Bam. The police are not going to help you this time. I've had second thoughts. I will let you beg for mercy, Father. I'm not going to do anything, Dad. I've changed my mind. Oh, Dad. I won't do it, Dad. I promise. I won't. I love you, Father. You're the best dad I've ever had. I, I, I can't. Ah. No. Oh, wait. Dad, don't do it. No, Dad, I love you. Oh. oh, my gosh. 
I'm I'm dead. Oh my god. My, my child. They, they are dead. Why, why do you keep saying they? Stupid developer. No, no, no! What have I done? He was the only thing I had left after my, my wife died. Okay, well, then you just murdered him. I have nothing left. You are a terrible person, father. Why, how could you do that? Oh. What? What just happened? Fatal ending. Are you happy? I mean, kind of. All right, so this next ending, I uh, have to spy on my father. See what he's uh, really going on in his head. He has psychological problems. So we just got to come back here and... Oh, there he is. What would my child be thinking if they saw me crying? Oh, father here. We got to listen to him. It's taking so long. I cannot let my child see me like this. Oh, daddy. Even though he just murdered me. My child finally left for school. <laughs> what was wrong with him today? He kept insisting he had to stay at home, but I just i i really just need some time alone i cannot let him see me like this oh father you are really bald he's been very strict these last days i do not wish to upset him any further i will leave now but i feel i'm not in any adequate state to go to school hmm i know i'll go spend my day with my mother i shall also gift her a flower okay so they're divorced i must take the forest path so i am not spotted and people tell father that i am not at school that's really smart okay so we have uh, different flowers here which one do i should i grab let's grab the pink one because it's so pretty Deliver the flower to mother. Okay, it's said to take the forest path. I'm guessing that means I go into the forest. Okay, uh, what do I do? Hello? Am I in the forest path? Mother? Oh, wait, what? Okay, it just became Minecraft. Minecraft music? Hello? Okay, so we gotta take this to mother. She's divorced my dad, and then she dug herself a hole in the forest, and I'm supposed to take this flower to her, apparently. Okay, mom, why would you uh, do this? This is just cringe, mother. Okay, I think I just follow these uh, squares on the ground. They shall eventually lead me to my mother's home. Oh, starting to rain. Oh! There's the sun and it's raining and there's lightning. Am I in Brazil or something? Am I in a favela? We're getting closer and closer to my mother. It is getting muddy. So I'm going to have to take my shoes off before I enter into her house. I hope you take your shoes off when you go inside. You know how dirty your shoes are full of dog crap? And then people crawl on the carpet and they have babies and stuff. Oh, oh, rip. Wait, what? My mother's dead? Oh my gosh, it's so sad. Okay, which one's hers? Do I just click it? Mother! Okay, which grave site is my mother's? Hello? Mom, forgive me. I forgot where you died. You died in my arms. I mean, I forgot where you are buried. Okay, there's like 50 gravestones out here. Bro, which one is it? I'm about to start raging. Oh, here it is. <laughs> mother's tombstone deliver flower. Hello, mother. I have brought you a beautiful flower. It's a pale flower. You always like them better than bright ones. Okay, that's the brightest flower I could find, by the way. Here, take it. That's a beautiful flower in front of my mother's grave. Is she gonna come up and grab my feet? Oh, zombies coming. Ah! Oh, the father? Why does he look so upset? What are you doing here? Why aren't you at school? Uh, I, I wanted to visit mother. I, I am not handling the grief very well. I miss mother too much. Going to school in the state is simply unproductive. I wanted to stay home today, but then I overheard you talking. You seem to require some time for yourself. Since mother's demise a week ago, you have become very strict. Okay, so she just died. My father probably killed her. He's a weirdo. I felt it unwise to upset you even further. That's why I came here. I couldn't go to school nor stay home. Okay, cool story, bro. Look what you did to my father. Look how upset he is. He's gonna murder me. Oh, I'm so sorry, father. I did not mean to make you angry. Yep, I knew it. I, I will go to school now. I apologize for my behavior. Oh, no, please. Father, please. Don't do it, Dad! No! No, don't call me Father. Stop being so formal. Call me Dad. Daddy? My child, I... I cannot do this anymore! All this time, just like you, I've been overwhelmed by grief. It all happened so quickly, I just felt like we had to move on as if nothing bad happened. I thought that I had to be a strong dad and to not let grief get the best of me! At the moment, I assume that's what she would have wanted. However, now I see things truly are. I'm not ready to move on yet. Wait, why? She just died a week ago. Why, why would you be ready? It takes like a like years sometimes to get over family that dies. But that's okay because we can go through this together until we're ready to go back to our regular lives. I think that's what she would have actually wanted. My child, I'm so sorry if I haven't been as good as... Okay, seriously, this story. Wow, yeah, father and son, they're going to grieve together. That's very good. Now, let's stay at home today. I'll call your teacher to tell him you're sick. Thank you, daddy. Good ending. You stayed at home with your dad. And now time for the final ending. I think I just go outside and go to school. Maybe I should put my clothes on first, but too late. Here's the school bus stop. 
All right. Are you extra super duper mega hyper sure? Yes. But this ending is boring. The rest of the game is much more fun. No, I need to go to school. If you leave this green area, the boring ending will be aborted. Well, I can't stop you. Actually, I can. If you want the ending so bad, then click this and wait 30 long, boring seconds without leaving the green area. Okay. So now do I literally just have to wait for 30 seconds? I see a kid in the background. He's like dancing. Hello? Kid, what are you doing out there? He's just being kind of crazy. All right. I hope that wasn't too boring. If this is too boring for you, it should. You can just leave and get the normal ending. No? I'm starting to think that I won't be able to convince you. That's a shame. Okay, I have an idea. If you really want this ending, then click here and wait 50 seconds without moving. Bro! Okay, it's actually not letting me move now. Hello? All this precious time wasted. I could be downstairs playing with my doge. Okay, you can move now. But aren't you, like, extremely bored? Or were you doing something else in real life while you waited? I wanted to be doing something else. Did you do that? Because that's cheating. Oh. No? Are you sure? Well, if you really didn't cheat, that means that you can wait another 80 seconds without doing anything, right? Click or leave. Oh my gosh, again, I cannot move. But 80 seconds is actually enough time to go play with Doge. I got 80 seconds to play with you, Doge. Oh, oh, that's just such a, such a good Doge right here. This is just such a cute Doge. I got 80 seconds to play with the Doge. 80 seconds have passed. I had a great time playing with Doge. Wait, no, that was 40 seconds. Oh wait, oh dear. That means you have to wait an extra 40 seconds or leave. Click this. Okay, back to playing with Doge. Oh, Doge, I got more time to play with you again, Doge. Just Good doge, good doge, good doge, good doge, good doge. Good, good. Now it's been 80 seconds. You are quite persistent, huh? That's true. Are you really that desperate for this ending? Yes, give it to me. I tell you, it's not worth it. It doesn't even have a fun cutscene, unlike the regular ending, which does have some fun cutscenes. So, you know, go play that one. No, 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 no. Okay. You did this to yourself. Don't say that I did not warn you. Hold this for 100 seconds and the ending will be yours or leave. Hold that. Wait, what? Oh my gosh, I have to actually hold it and break my uh, my finger. Stupid sussy developer. Fingers starting to break. Can barely feel my fingers anymore. I, I, I don't know if I can keep pressing this, but th there's just a few more seconds to go. It, it's so painful. Uh, uh, come on, just... I can do it. I, I, I can do it. Uh, come on. Oh, ah, oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I burned so many calories pressing that button. <gasps> yeah, we got into the school bus. And we got the bad ending. Hey, you went to school. How boring. That's true. School is boring and for losers. Ah, uh, another lovely day in my bed. Oh! Did someone just kill the rooster? Someone's stabbing it. Woohoo! Today is the day that GTA 6 releases. But I'm not old enough to buy it. Maybe I can convince my brother to buy it for me. Alright, so I gotta go talk to my brother. Ooh. Hey, what's this over here? Huh. Someone left money on the floor and at the computer? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay, let's, uh, brother, where are you? We gotta go buy GTA 6. Hey! <laughs> wow, my brother's huge. Hey, brother, can you buy this game for me since I have, uh, so good grades? Why can't you buy it? Because uh, I'm not old enough. I'm so young, I haven't even grown hair out. All right, well, uh, I'm not paying for it, so you better have some money for my service. I gotta get money somehow. There should be some money laying around in my room. All right, you just stay there, brother. I'll be right back. All right, so we got some money on my desk. We got some money under the uh, my closet here. Do I have any money in the bathroom? <gasps> money on the toilet. Oh my gosh. Oh, I forgot to flush, by the way. <laughs> oh, look, there's money on the bathtub, All right? So we'll grab that. All right, brother, look, I got, um, I don't see how much money I have, actually. Hey, uh, tell me how much I have. All right, so he's gonna inspect my wallet. Can barely see it. Five dollars. Nah. Okay, maybe there's some money elsewhere in the house. Yeah, five dollars isn't gonna cut it. GTA 6 probably is gonna cost like seventy dollars before taxes. All right. Um. What? Wait. Where did I just go? Oh, sorry, brother. I was just playing in like uh, I don't even know what that was. All right, let's go this way. That was my brother's room. All right. Oh, is this my mom? Hey, <laughs> mom, give me some money. I need to go buy a video game that's really violent. All right, so let's get some money by the chimney, some money in the kitchen, some more money in the kitchen. Any money in the fridge? No. My mom is watching absolutely nothing. Just a blue screen. She's not talking to me. What if she's actually dead? Uh, let's go into here. What is this? A closet? Oh, it's a garage. Okay, so we'll grab some of that. And wait, what? I can go out. There's a world. Oh my gosh, this game is like GTA. It's open world. I can go out here. Can I like beat up people? Hey, come here. I'm going to smack you in the head. <laughs> okay, no, I can't. Any money in my pool? Uh, the answer is no. What about in the backyard here? I don't see any money anywhere. Okay, well, I need to go back inside, talk to my brother. I probably have like $10, which is not going to be enough. Hey, brother, can you see how much money I have? Uh, let's see. So that's about 14 No, it's, yeah, $10. It's better, but still not enough. So, oh yeah, I got a piggy bank. Let's break it. I'm just picking up $1 bills everywhere. All right, let's break my piggy bank. Okay. 
And, oh yeah, see, so I had like $7 in there. All right, brother, I got some more money. So let's see, how much do I have? 15, 18, okay, give me more, hee hee. Yeah, we're like $40 short. All right, maybe mom can give me some money. I don't know, she's kind of dead on the couch watching nothing, just a blue screen of death. All right, mom. Hi! Hey, son can i get some money why and how much i need to buy some school books i need ten dollars for that bro you should have asked for like fifty dollars all right then so that was an easy ten dollar yeah you know should have asked for more money school books are a ripoff brother i have money now show uh it's only 28 dollars. okay i want more dude actually at this point he should put in the rest because then we can both share the game bruh maybe i can sell flowers outside all right brother since you're being a scammer i'm going to go outside all right, so we have some flowers. Let's just pick a bunch of flowers. My mom was, is probably going to be mad. It says I need to get 12, so... All right, yeah, just spam E key. All right, so we have 12 flowers. Who's buying flowers? This guy here. He's buying flowers. Hello. Oh, he just gave me $10. Wait, can I get more? Wait, no, I can't pick more. Okay, that's actually the easiest $10 I've ever made in my life. What if that was true? You just go out, pick 100 flowers, and get $100. Brother, I beg your pardon for my disturbance, but can you check again? Okay, so do I have $38 now? 38 I want more, so he's still not happy. Bruh, maybe I can cut down our trees and sell them. Okay, this is actually turning into a really good game because I love destroying nature, but you would only know that if you've been watching my videos for years. All right, how do I cut down trees? What do I do? Oh, get axe from garage. Okay, so I get to wield a weapon. Here we go. <laughs> Got an axe. All right, come here. We're playing L uh, Lumber Tycoon 2. Yeah, give me that. And, oh wait, we just sell one at a time. How much are you buying a log for, sir? $5. Okay, so let's just cut down four more trees. I'm about to make $25 for this. That's pretty awesome. All right, I'm just going to cut down the trees behind them because they're closer. Here you go. And give me another log, please. Sell that. And then the last one. Okay, so this will give me 25 more dollars. That'll take me to around uh, 50 something. <laughs> Who cares about math? It's boring. Check my wallet. Okay. I see 53 three dollars 38 dollars wait what how's it 38 dollars okay this is serious now i'm going to rob people walking outside the house bro so i made zero dollars i'm i'm confused is the developer broken all right hey uh just gonna rob you thank you okay so we got two dollars give me your money yes so they just kind of spawn i just kind of punch them in the gut take their money this is a shop okay we're gonna go there eventually but let's kick this guy in the nuts thank you for the money speed run leaderboard so you can speed run four minutes 33 seconds i can beat that easy Okay, we got, uh, oh wait, I have to rob one more. Bills, donate. Why would I donate? Is this Boba? He wants five Boba. I don't think so. I'm poor. Here, give me your money. Bam! Punch him right in the gut. That's how it's done, folks. All right, so we got, what, $10? I must have lost my tree cutting down money because, yeah, I didn't get anything from that. All right, so, oh, wait, we're at $60 now. Okay, now it's adding up. If mom notices me buying a game too old for you, she'll ground me. So? So give me more money. Hmm, how can I get money? I know, I can sell mom's car. That is a brilliant idea. Hey mom, I know you're just passed out here. So I'm gonna grab your car keys. There they are, thank you. And you just stay there, mom. Okay, I'm just gonna <laughs> close the door and uh, let's see. How do I sell the car? Let's see, uh, buy, oh, this guy's just buying cars conveniently right outside my house. That's perfect. Hey, got the car to sell? <laughs> Why, yes I do. See that little pink one in the back? <laughs> Yeah, that one's, uh, it's, it needs to be sold, please. I don't know. I think it's a Lamborghini. Yeah, that's a Lambo. Oh, you know, Lamborghinis are bad nowadays, so I'll give you 200 for that. $200 for, like, an eight-year-old? That's perfect. Is that a new Lamborghini update? All right, then. Perfect. I'll take the car away, then. Okay, so there he goes with this little, uh, miniature forklift. And I got $1,000! Okay, that was way more than 200 Okay, I can buy a lot of GTA 6s. Uh, Mom, don't go in the garage, please. Hey, uh, I got so much money. I'm actually a mob boss now. And 206 Bro, what? How do I only have... Oh, I get... I'm pocketing the other one or the rest of the money. So you can get the game for me? <laughs> no, I want more. Bro, okay, well, he did pay me $1,000. Maybe I can fill my pool with money. Wait, what? Why would I want to do that? I just got $1,000 from selling my mom's car. And then I told my brother that I only got 200 So I actually pocketed the other $800. All right, I'm supposed to pray. Plutus, the god of money, hear my prayers. Actually, the god of money is Mammon, and it's evil. Okay, uh, what the heck is that? Hello? Fill my pool with thine wealth. What? Fill my pool with money! Uh, okay. Okay, so I just farted, and now my pool is filled up with money. All right, and he exploded. Awesome. Okay, so I got $10,000. I can actually walk on my cash. But now it's gonna rain and ruin it. Oh, brother, I, uh... I did some evil stuff and got some money. Here, I have... 
$1,060. Okay, so I pocketed $9,000. Wow, that's much money, but I want more. So rob a store or something. Great idea, brother. Great idea indeed. Do I need to find a shotgun? That's what you use to rob stores in case you're wondering. Okay, so let's go to the store. This is a store or a shop rather. And let's bash the ATM with a hammer. That's what I like to do. Okay, uh, hi. You literally have nothing in here. What, what's it a rob? Can I steal the bat, by the way? No? Okay. This is a robbery. Give me all you got. Uh, we don't have any money. We just opened our shop here. Wow. You know, I really just want some money for GTA 6. Sad face. You know what? You can take this baseball bat next to me. Smash the ATM outside to get some cash. Really? Thank you so much. Dude, that is actually a genius idea. Here, I'm going to grab that. That's a huge bat, by the way. Okay, ATM. Break. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, hit it again. Yeah. Keep smashing it. Come on. Do it, do it, do it before the police arrive. I'm actually playing GTA 6 right now. This is the, the new update. Oh, brother. I committed a felony. Ow. So he says I have... Whoa. Suddenly we have $11,500. More money. That's it. I'm selling this house. <laughs> That's perfect. Oh, look. This guy's conveniently selling uh, or buying houses. Let's talk to him. Hey, want to sell your house? Yes, sir. I'm guessing your house is the one behind you. Yep. Okay. I'll give you $100,000 for it. That's a pretty good deal for that crappy house. Wow, that's a lot of money. Sure. All right, then. I'll get started with moving your house. Okay, good. Here comes the, uh, what was that? Helicopter? I don't know what that is, but it's coming to move my house, apparently. And there it goes. It just teleported up. My mom is chilling. My brother's chilling. House is gone, but we still have a lot of money in the pool, so... We're, we're doing all right. All right, brother. I sold the house. It's time for you to buy GTA 6. Finally. Come on. One million dollars. Nice, but not nice enough. Give me more. Dude, what is wrong with this guy? Need more money. All right. Sell the earth to aliens. That's a really good idea. Who do I talk to for that? Is it right here? Oh, talk to aliens. Okay. If I fart so much that the earth stinks, the aliens will have to notice me. Duh. Let's do this. I have to. All right. Here we go. Just going to fart. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Summoning aliens. Oh, okay. So the alien, the stench reach the cosmos. What is this smelly planet? Hey aliens, this is the earth. I own it. Oh, okay. Do you want to buy it for one trillion? Yeah, sure. This planet smells really good. We'll come back later and take the planet. Sounds good. All right. So we just got a trillion dollars. Let's see if that's enough to buy GTA 6. Hey brother, check it out. One trillion or whatever. This is enough. All right. I'll go buy the game for you. Finally. Thank you, brother. Okay. We finally sold the, uh, the earth full of fart gas to the aliens. They're going to take it away and everyone will die because being away from the sun means you die. All right. We got the good ending. We also got GTA six. That's exciting. And now I'm going to speed run the game. The, the speed run record is like four minutes, 33 seconds. Ow. Okay. The game starts when the timer starts. Okay. So we just got to skip her. Is there like, okay, there we go. We gotta go. Just, uh, talk to brother. Okay. Uh, skip, 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 skip. And then, okay, stop. Oh, I can open. Okay. Bro, stop wasting time. All right. So we gotta get that, get that. Find money in rooms. Oh no. Oh, no, I'm failing. Oh, no, I was in the stupid bathroom. Okay, I should probably start over. Oh, whatever, let's just go see how good we do. Brother, how much do I have? Dude, this is wasting time. Okay, uh, find money in the house. All right, so we got to go get the counter money, the kitchen money. And I believe there's one in the garage. Yes, there we go. I hate how this part takes so long. Just wasting time. Okay, we got to break my piggy bank. Yeah, smash it. Get all the money. All right, guys, we are making a decent time. Mom, time to wake up from your slumber. I am speed running. Okay, we got the $10 from our dear mother. All right, this guy needs to buy the flowers. We're at 1 minute 15 seconds. Okay, get axe from the garage. And then we got to go chop down some trees. We're just going to chop this one. And then we're going to chop the trees behind the house. Last tree, last tree, last tree. There's probably like a special order to do the trees. Oh my gosh, we're already at two minutes. Oh no, this robbing part, this is going to be the worst because sometimes there's like no people out here. Hey, come on. Punch you in the ball. Look, yeah. See, there's no one else out here. Oh, my gosh. Am I supposed to speed run this point? All right. Kick him. There's currently nobody out here. Can I rob these people in the stands, please? It'd be a lot easier. I cannot. So this part's definitely the hardest part of the speed run. We're already almost at three minutes. Where is this last person? There he is. Kick you in the gut. Not going well. Okay. Sell mom's car. I think we just go straight to this guy. I don't have to do anything in the garage, right? Yeah. Okay. So sell it. He takes it. Dude, skip. Skip this part, please. That took way longer than one or two. I don't think I'm going to get the record 
I'm not doing good. All right, fill the money with pool. Now we have to go uh, pray to this idiot. I guess a loser on the planet. All right, here, go fast. Come on. Okay, so he fills up the money. It's gonna explode. And hurry up, let me move. Three minutes, 50 seconds. What if I actually got in the leaderboard? I really want to get on there. Oh my gosh, I gotta go to the stupid store. Oh boy, okay. Uh, What do we need to... Uh, okay, I think we need to get like under five minutes to get on the leaderboard. All right, don't think that's gonna happen. We're already at 412. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, this is taking way too long. Did the people that actually speed run this first place, guys, he hacking? He got like 430. I'm already at 427. Probably a hacking loser. I think I have to sell the house next. Yes. We go to this idiot. Take the house, please. I can't skip this part. You're kidding me. Oh, look, I'm moving. I can actually move. Okay, so we're just gonna go over to the brother. Okay, so there I am. Look, look, we're at the brother right now. And then let's sell the house to aliens. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, it's still going. No, we have to watch this whole cutscene. Uh, why is this part of the speed run? How the heck do you get four minutes, 33 seconds? What is this smelly planet? Yeah, just let me skip. I can't even skip this. Dude, I'm pressing everything. All right, now we gotta talk to the brother. Okay, skip that. Okay, five is still going. Bro, this is such a horrible run. Hello? Six minutes? Okay, well, it's still going. Okay, 604. Trash. So here's the leaderboard. Number one is 433. What well, I got 64. Oh, look, I'm number 61 in the world. Dude, I can definitely do better than that. I'm going to run it again. I just sold flowers. I'm at one minute, 10 seconds. And I'm just going to chop the logs behind the, the booth here. I think this is the best way to do it. I'm done chopping. I'm at 147. And now the hard part, robbing people. It's going to take me a whole minute. Come on, come on, spawn. Come on, get out. Thank you. I'm selling the car at about three minutes. Come on, hurry up and take it. Wasting my time. There's no way to to get the 433 unless you're like actually speed hacking. The end cutscene alone takes like a whole minute. So yeah, mister at the top there, you're just a stupid hacker. Hope your account gets deleted for hacking because you're a loser. And then this part takes like 10 seconds. Look how long this is taking. Come on. So I'm at the selling house part right at the uh, world record. Uh, yeah, there's no way he did that without speed hacking. But look, I can at least walk into the house while this part happens, which I can't skip. Okay, we're now at 435. We're at the speed hackers time. Stupid blatant hackers. All right, time to do the dumb farting part. What a good beat. Come on, let's get this over with. 520. Just wasting time. So maybe the hackers made it so they could skip. I don't know. Take my money. Still counting. What's it gonna stop at? Bam. 548. So that's actually the best uh, time in the world if you don't speed hack. So I'm number one in the world without speed hacking. The leaderboard says we're just gonna skip all these speed hackers here. I'm number 34 in the world. So I'm actually number one if you don't count the speed hacker. These are all speed hackers here. Feels good to be the best in the world. Ah, such a pleasant day. It's early in the morning. Ah, freaking alarm. No, today is Monday. But I don't really feel like going to school today. Wait, I can just convince my grandma I'm not fit for school. <laughs> That's cool. Let's convince her that I'm actually insane. Time to go talk to her. Talk to grandma. Okay, where is she? Oh, this is a nice home. Who the heck wakes up at seven in the morning? Are you serious? That's really cringing. That's just the cutest kitty I've ever seen in my life. All right, well, let's go find my granny. Wait, what the heck? Who's that? Is that Russo Plays? No, that's not Russo. <laughs> I thought that was Russo. Uh, this is a beautiful TV with a white screen. Lots of cat pictures everywhere because grandmas love cats. Warning, gamers only. <laughs> Freaking nerds playing games. What kind of nerd plays a game? Anyway, Grandma, are you in here? Uh, no, this is a bathroom. She's uh, not taking a crap, but I will be soon because I just woke up. Oh, look at that beautiful doggo. Yeah, let's go in here. Oh, this is the garage, so we don't want to go in there. Uh, Grandma, there she is. Oh, Grandma, you're looking really beautiful today. You're up really early, by the way. Hey, Grandma, is it all right if I skip school today? No, oh, why would I allow you to do that, silly boy? Of course not. Now go get ready for school. Yeah, that's my grandma voice. Look at, yeah, no. Stick a fork into the toaster. World chaos is currently at 0%. Okay, so we gotta go find a fork. And then with that fork, we're going to put the toaster. Wait, why? Hello? Oh, it's got the Mario jumping sound. I love it. It's so cute. Okay, come on, let me up. I know I'm a midget, but I gotta get this fork. Wait, I, I don't grab that fork. Oops. Well, where the heck do I grab a fork? Hello, put fork into toaster. Okay, I guess I already have one in my pocket. There we go. This will surely make grandma believe me. We are now at 2% chaos. Hey, grandma, I might have started a fire. Did you see what I did in the kitchen? You broke the toaster. Really? What a dumb thing to do. Go get ready for school now. Oh, man, I made grandma angry. Tip over the trash. That doesn't seem nearly as chaotic as setting the house on fire, but the developer tells me what to do. So let's tip it over. Uh-oh. <laughs> I ain't going to school. The next thing I do will surely make her think I'm insane. Trample grandma's garden. Ooh, yay. I get to go destroy more stuff out in nature. Here, here. Stupid flower. Oh, wait. 
That doesn't count as a garden. Okay. Well, where is grandma's garden? Is it in the backyard? Wait, no, there's nothing back here. Oh, here it is. What is she growing? She's growing carrots? Okay. <laughs> Grandma, your garden sucks! Just trampling it. Yeah! Yeah! Destroy this piece of crap garden. Oh, I set it on fire, actually, so I did more than trampling. That's a lot of chaos. Ha! Grandma's garden is no more. I didn't like her carrots anyway. Oh, look, it's Grandma's lovely farm. Don't trample. This one is still on fire. That's pretty cool. I cannot jump through the window. Hey, Grandma! I might have destroyed your precious carrots. Good luck getting those carrots out, Grandma. You should be at school soon, mister. I can deal with your mess later. Burn Grandma's nits. Man, it seems like nothing is bothering Grandma at this point. I gotta start going further. So I really am going insane. So where are Grandma's nits? Not in the garage. Was it in the bathroom? No. Wait, maybe they're in her room. So I'm just, uh, Grandma, don't mind me. I'm just gonna just, uh, burn your nits behind you. Oopsie! Throw Grandma's pillow. Pillows on the floor. Okay, Grandma, you stay there. She's getting really mad at me. Uh, throw a pillow. Yeah! <laughs> Stupid pillow, jump on it! <laughs> Your pillow sucks, getting mud all over it. Turn the TV on loud, okay? Uh, where's the remote? Here we go. Aha, uh -huh, we got the, your dumb stupid kitty show on really loud. But grandma's kind of deaf, so she can't hear it anyway. Turn the radio on loud. Okay, where's the radio? Let's oh, back over here. All right. Okay, good. That's perfect. Yes. Oh, yeah. I love that sound. Nothing better than farting. Break the fish tank. Okay, now we're getting crazy. Did I say crazy? I meant crazy. Grandma, where's your fish tank? Oh, she keeps it on the little coffee table. Hey, stop farting, dude. Everything's getting loud. Oh! Oh my gosh, it's Nemo. Nemo, I'm so sorry. Oh, I can kick Nemo around. <laughs> wait, did, wait, did I kick her or did he flop? Oh! Nemo, come back! Okay, I don't know what Nemo's doing, but I think he's going to die. I'm sorry, Grandma. I killed Nemo. Is that loud enough for you, Grandma? Of course not. Now stop making messes. You might have missed the bus already. Oh my gosh, dang, I forgot how old she is. Her hearing is that bad? Yeah, I just said that. Break every painting and light them on fire. Okay, so we get to break Russo. All right, Russo, you're now broken, lit on fire. Where is... Oh, I can light this one through the wall, but let's just do it from here because it's funnier. Oh, the poor kitty. Oh, I gotta break this one and then that one. Okay. Oh, there's one above her bed. Sorry, Grandma, your painting sucks. Uh, what's some other paintings? We got a uh, cute dog. I don't... Why am I ruining the dog? Here, can I kick the... Oh, I kicked the fish again. Stupid fish. So I'll break the kitty one, that one. So this game is definitely chaos. We got a painting in my... Why am I breaking my own painting? I'm so stupid doing all this just because I don't want to go to school. That's called mental illness. Go talk to Grandma. Okay. We're at 21% chaos. Hey, Grandma, is it all right if I borrow something? As long as you're finally getting ready for school, then sure. Thanks, Grandma. So I got to take her away. Give me that. Ah, you're bald. <laughs> ah, ah, bald Grandma. I have to hide in here. Okay, I uh, hid in the... Uh, yeah, it's hidden. I put in the muffler. So when you actually start the car, it's going to explode. Wait, just kidding. I put it on the roof. Short circuit the house by flipping grandma's light switch fast. Okay, grandma, you stay there. Ready? Ah, grandma. <laughs> Annoying kid, you turn off all the power. That's right. Break every window and light them on fire. Okay, so I'm going to burn glass. So, okay. Just, here, come on, glass. Get out. And we're going to burn this one. Wait, it's not breaking. Oh, well, we're just... Uh, Wait, what's... Babies? We got two babies in the crib. Oh my god, they're so creepy. His eyes are just fully black. He's got a demon inside of him. All right, let's go break this window over here. And let's break this one, this one. We got a lot of windows in this house. That's nice. And the bathroom window. Okay, I'm missing one. Wait, which one am I missing, Grandma? Oh, it's in the garage. I found it. Get broken, stupid window. In the garage, there's a gas canister. Pour it all over Grandma's car and light it on fire. Okay, that sounds really fun. Hey, Grandma. I'm just going to pour gas all over car. Oh, no. Grandma, your car's on fire. It might explode soon. Stupid fish. Let me kick it. There we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You suck fish. Come here. How do you like the house now? You're going to burn the whole place down. That's right, Grandma. Maybe you shouldn't send me to school. Go flood the bathroom by filling up the bathtub. Okay, stupid fish. All right, so let's uh, fill up the bath. There we go. That's a huge bath. It goes above my head. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay, so the water can just stay in there. Wait, why does the water not flow into the house? Whatever. That's a good question. I flooded the bathroom with water so it doesn't light on fire. That's not what I meant. Are you going to let me stay home from school? Light the babies on fire. Okay. Hey, children. I might have to burn you. Oh, no. The demon babies are on fire. Oh, my gosh, babies. I'm so sorry. Kind of. Ah that's right, Grandma. I'm a murderer. Bring a beehive into Grandma's room. Now, that is what I'm talking about because they're gonna sting me in the butt!
Where the heck is a beehive? Oh, it's out here. Hey, bees. That's kind of scary. Let me just uh, grab that. Okay. Ow. Ow. Ah. Ah. They're stinging. So sharp. They hurt. Ah. 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 Please stop. Stop stinging me. Stop stinging. Okay. I'm just going to leave it there. Grandma. Bye. Oh, I'm supposed to talk to her. Stupid bees. Ow. 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 You like bees? Ah. Ah. Stop. These things are stinging me! They're also stinging the babies that are on fire. Then tell me I don't have to go to school, Grandma. Call a construction company to bulldoze the house down. All right, here we go. Hmm. Which one should I use? I can close the door. Oops. Oh, a new call. Hello, hello. This is your trusty construction company here to help with anything. Hey, man, I need this old house demolished. Any chance you can do it within, let's say, a minute? Why, yes, of course. <laughs> We're on our way. And they're going to do it for free. That's really awesome. Oh. Oh! Oh! That was a massive boulder. The house kind of blocked it, though. Did you see that? Hey, thanks for the good work. I'm on the phone, but no problem. Anytime you need me, just call. I will. Chaos 100%. Wow! What are you gonna do now? Blow up the world? Wait. No more world? No more school. Grandma, that's a great idea. Oh, man. I'm so excited. Spawn the car and get it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, ah! My freaking head, dude. Somehow I'm alive. This says it's a Jeep, but that's clearly not a Jeep. All right, Grandma, you stay there. I'm going to uh, get in the car and do what you said. <laughs> Excuse me, Grandma. Oh, sorry, Mr. Lumberjack Man. Uh, wait, can I run over my Grandma? Hold on. I just want to come. Move, Grandma. Die. Die. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm running you over, Granny. What's this? Oh, that's donation. I don't want to donate. Drive the car into the tunnel. Okay, here we go. Wait, that's not it. All right, let's just back up. I guess I'm going in the wrong tunnel. Freaking scam tunnel. Die, Grandma. She doesn't want to die. All right, let's go in here. And I drive off into the sunset. Oh, it's a hazmat suit, man. He says, I repeat, I repeat, intruder in the facility. What? Hey, you need more chaos? Easy. I'm launching a nuke to end the world. No. Uh-oh. What? Okay, there goes the nuke. And I hear it coming. And what? Ah, uh, ah. Oh! Okay, we got 9,000 million percent chaos. All right, that is the good ending. And then the stupid developer kicks me. What a jerk. All right, now it's time to get the bad ending. You have to get to the part where you break all the paintings. So we're just going to speed run this really quickly. Stupid garden get trampled. <laughs> My favorite part, breaking the fishbowl so I can kick the stupid fish. Wait, it's not working. You dumb fish, get stepped on. All right, now we got to break all the paintings. And this is where we actually get the bad ending. So I think I break four or five. Oh, yeah, see the school bus is just chilling. Yeah, Grandma, you know what? I had a change of heart. Uh. Your house sucks. It kind of smells and you have no food. So I'm actually just going to go to school. I will get food there. All right. See you later, Grandma. I'm going to go have a great time with my friends. We're just uh, not going to listen to our teachers. And there's the bad ending. Our garden is still destroyed and on fire. So for the last ending, I have to murder the babies and then bring the beehive into Grandma's room. Time to speed run. Stupid garden. It's trash. Hey, Grandma, say goodbye to your car again. <laughs> All right, so now we light the babies on fire. They're really scary. And now, instead of getting a beehive, I talk to the phone. I call 911. Shut up, TV. So loud. Let me close the door. A new call. 911, what's your emergency? Help! My grandma's murdering babies. What's your location? One, two, three, chaos lane. Our SWAT team is on their way. Freeze! Grandma, you're under arrest for murder! Hi! Oh, Grandma, you're causing so much chaos. How could you do that? Murder babies? Innocent babies? How could you do that? Liar's ending. So that is the final ending. Stupid developer forcing me to leave. What if I don't want to leave? You can't tell me what to do. <sighs> Another day. Yikes. 30 minutes until breakfast. I should head out soon. That's probably still asleep. <laughs> like always. That door is super creaky, though. Maybe I should open it slowly. But first, let me grab my cape. I am a superhero, after all. That's that's right, folks. I'm pretty super. So let's just grab the only pair of clothing in my closet. If you even want to call a cape a pair of clothing. I literally have no underwear or socks or anything. I, I just free ball it all day. All right, so let's head on out. And what's this? Oh, hey, Dad. <laughs> what you doing, man? See that you're up before me and you haven't shaved. All right, Dad. Uh, I'm going to head out here. Wait, what? Oh, okay, so the door apparently is really hard to open. You have to, you have to open it carefully. 
Okay, what, what, what's that mean? I'm not sure what that means, so I'm just gonna hold down the E key until it opens. And there we go. It just gets easier every morning. I should get going. People may need my help. Another day in the town. Time to save people. Whoa, whoa. Okay, apparently I can shoot lasers out of my eyes. Wait. Hey, man, what's up? Uh, I'm just gonna melt you. Hold on. Can I go first person mode? No. Okay, so I'm melting this guy's feet. That's pretty awesome. Let's see. What does he want? Hey, vitamin. I lost some stuff around here. Have you seen my keys? Uh, no, I just woke up. Yeah, I, I just keep losing them. I know they're around here somewhere, though. Look at that little cute little kitty on his shoulder. Would you mind helping me find them? Yeah, okay, I'll be happy to. All right, so how do I find your items, though? Where, where'd you leave them? Let's well, see, I got different powers. <gasps> I can fly? Wait, wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot I'm a superhero, duh. All right, let's just uh, fly up, see if we can find any special items around here. Okay, so far, I don't see... I see a kitty up on the tree. Are you a lost kitty? How do I get you? Ah, ah, ah! Oh, I thought I was falling out of the sky. That was kind of scary. All right, anyway, what, what, wait. Oh, I have x-ray vision. Ooh. And, oh, these red items, I think these are what he lost. Oh, what's this over here? Is that a shovel? Wait, how do I get it? Grab shovel. Okay, I got a shovel. One out of four found. Okay, good. What's wrong with you? Is your car frozen? Okay, hey, I'll come back for you. Hold on, I gotta finish finding this guy's stupid stuff that he threw around the village. What's his uh, keys? So grab his keys. And then up on the roof. Oh, you know what? It's time to fly. Here we go. Ah, yeah. And let's switch over and grab the wallet. And where's the last one? Is it in the house? Okay, hold on. Uh, just gonna sneak. Don't mind me. <laughs> just being a superhero after all. And it's outside the house. Okay, uh, sorry. Bye. I'm not gonna walk around. I'm going to fly. All right, here we go. So we're flying up over the house. And we... Oh, ah! Okay, I'm still getting used to this flying thing. Okay, I'm new. And we found this phone. Okay, so we got four out of four objects. Well, uh, it's just gonna fly over the house again because it's really cool to do. And we're gonna head back to the... Oh! Why does that happen every time I fly? Man, it's so hard flying. Hooray, you found them. You said my wallet was on the roof? How did I freaking get there? Thanks for your help. <laughs> Happy to help, sir, anytime. All right, so we got one out of four neighbors helped. Uh, let's go help this guy with his block car. His car is frozen, apparently. Hey, I'm so glad to see you. Good morning. What's up with your car? That's the thing. I woke up this morning. I went to go heat up the car. And boom, it was just covered in a block of ice. Weirdly, even enough, it's even not below freezing. Yeah, that's pretty weird. Please tell me you can help out. I have to get to work in 15 minutes. Don't worry, man. I happen to have these eyeballs that melt everything. Look here, just you're in my way. What if I melt him right in the ball? <laughs> I'm melting his ball. Okay, so we shoot the car. And okay, yeah, the ice is melting. But this is taking way too long. Wait, really? Are my uh, heat vision powers just weak or something? Okay, whoops. Sorry about that. Okay, uh, we're just going to melt the ice. It's taking a lot longer than it should. Sorry, I'm kind of rusty to the superhero thing. I'm uh, kind of new. I'm still learning how to fly. Come on. Almost there. Well, uh, oh, I'm accidentally hitting car. The car's going to explode. Just kidding. Dude, I think the ice is no longer melting. Hello? It's just really slow down here. Dude, finally. You did it. Hooray. I can't thank you enough. Now I can get to work. <laughs> no problem. Maybe keep your car in the garage next time, you idiot. I saw you do that cool laser thing out of your eyes. Do you think you could uh, heat up this coffee? I'd love to help, sir. All right. So we got to uh, heat up his coffee. Okay, hold on. Sorry if I melt you. Wait, am I even hitting it? Hold on. Uh, dude, I can't see. Is it even, am I even hitting it? I can't. Okay, hold on, hold on. Just wait. What, can I fly and then heat up? No, I can only do one thing at a time. Okay, hold on. Let's go up on the car. And then, all right. I can't see. Dude, such terrible programming. Okay, we got it. Finally, I think I uh, lit him on fire. Should be nice and toasty, but not too hot. Thank you so much. Yeah, he's so happy. It's not a superhero breakfast without coffee. All right, that's two out of four idiots that have been helped. Oh, uh, we got this uh, crazy looking lady over here. Vitamin, I'm glad to see you. <laughs> Good morning, neighbor. Where's your, uh, your cat? I was wondering this same thing until i looked up muffin ran off and got up this tree could you help me get her down i'll try my best <laughs> hold on <laughs> she better become my girlfriend after this because this is gonna take a lot of work so i have to fly up and where's he muffin hey hold, hold on muffin i'm coming all right actually muffin what i okay uh excuse me stupid flight all right let's try this again not fall off the tree okay muffin stay okay good actually i'm gonna melt your kitty <laughs> melt the stupid cat okay i guess i can't melt the cat and now let's fly down with muffins and okay stop flying what the heck here you go she didn't put up much of a fuss 
Oh my gosh, thank you! It's okay, she's fine now. Thanks again, Vitamin. Bye, I just friend zoned you. Freaking. What's this? Read note. Huh, a note. I wonder who left this. Hello, Vitamin. We've been looking forward to meeting you. Looking forward to meeting me? We have kept a watchful eye on you all these years. You're a good person with a pure heart, just what our team needs. Unlike your father, you believe in helping and doing good with your powers. Yeah, I do. Meet us in the forest in front of your house. Hope to see you there. Uh, the forest in front of my house. I guess that's over here. Well, why walk when I could fly? All right, who's over here? Hold on, hello, where are you? I'm here to... Wait, oh, hello? Looks like you got our note, Vitamin. Yeah, I did, but who are you guys? The three. Only the most powerful superhero group on Earth. Wait, you guys have superpowers? Mm-hmm, and we use them for good just like you. Yes, exactly. But we would like for you to join us. You've proven you can be valuable to the team. So what do you say, Vitamin D? Oh, I mean, this is awesome! But what about my dad? We'll deal with him eventually. Hmm, okay. Wait, what? The three. You join the three, a powerful superhero. Okay, so we got our first ending. Okay, this time we're not going to talk to that note. So first we're going to fall down because I can't fly. I'm going to grab the wallet and then the shovel and then the keys are over here. And then, okay, stop. Seriously, such a terrible superhero. We'll grab the phone and then we'll turn them in. And next we're going to melt this block of ice. But of course, this can take like 30 minutes. And that's finally done. But I forgot this is stupid coffee. Am I even hitting it, sir? And now I grab the kitty. Come here. And I give her the kitty. Now we need a one more neighbor. It's probably someone in this house. Hello? Any of you got a quest for me? I'm a superhero. No? Okay, let's go over here. And this is a nice little bed. Oh, it's my birthday in like five days. Oh yeah? Well, happy birthday, dude. Thanks, man. What are you gonna get me? Uh, I'm still thinking. You forgot, didn't you? Yeah, I'm sorry, dude. Well, maybe you can make it up for me. Hmm, I'll see what I can do. Find a way to make it up for him. There's something on your table I can just steal from you and then wrap it up in, in a wrapping paper and then give it to you and pretend I bought it. Hopefully no one invisible is listening. <laughs> well, I can become invisible. Wait, I have to hold it down. I can become invisible. Look at that. Yeah, he's inside of his room. So what do you think we should get him? Look at me in the corner over here. Hmm, I heard him talking about wanting that new action figure. <laughs> a new action figure, huh? I think he'll really love it. He's been talking about it for days. Well, what about that new book he wanted? <laughs> a book. Oh, you're right. Hmm. How about we get them both? Wow, that's a great idea. Okay, so let's run back and uh, tell the boy what I just heard from his parents. Dude, you won't believe what I found out. What, dude? I know exactly what you're getting for your birthday. Wait, how? <laughs> that's a secret. You have to at least tell me what it is. You did forget my birthday after all. Ha, <laughs> right. So you're getting an action figure and a book. I'm not sure what book though. Dude, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Thanks so much, man. Hey, no problem, bro, but I better get going. Okay, bye. Go back home in time for breakfast. All right, yeah, we just accomplished everything I wanted to do before 7 a.m. But why would I walk back when I could fly back? <laughs> Let's just fly back into my bed. What? What exactly are you doing outside? Uh, father, I was just, uh, getting some, uh, getting some fresh air. Is that so? Yup. Uh, you think I don't know? Know what, father? Do not play innocent with me, son. I don't know what you're talking about, father. You know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm putting an end to this. <gasps> father, wait! Fly up to space to stop your father! Oh, Daddy! Dad! Oh, father, don't do this. The planet is filled with life. You can't just take that away. A and I won't let you. You were always like your mother. These people are nothing. A speck on the face of this universe. We can start anew. Leave this world behind. You, me, we aren't like these people. Huh. How, how could you be so heartless? I am giving you a choice to join me or die. <laughs> I'm not like you. I'm nothing like you. Then this is your destiny. Uh, shoot at your father with you. Dad, I'll, I'll do it. Are you really going to die for a bunch of nobodies? If it's the right thing, think vitamin think. I've already made up my mind. Ah! Oh. Ending Scorched Earth. Earth was destroyed in the aftermath, but hey, at least you defeated your father. Well, that was pretty crazy. Unlock the villain ending. Are you sure you want to go to bed? Like, come on, you're a hero. You can't do this. You're so persistent, but I'll try to convince you, though. The rest of the game is way more fun. I don't think you've even got to use your powers yet. With great powers come great responsibility. Okay, there's no convincing you. Hold me for 10 seconds to get the ending. All right. Yeah, you know what? I'm just not feeling it today. Oh, wait. Yeah, anyway, I'm just not feeling it today. I had a really intense battle with my father. It was like super 
anime and stuff. So yeah. Ah, you thought it would be that easy. Wait, what? I'm going to make it hard for you to get the ending, but actually hold me for 20 seconds. Wait, dude, bro. I think I have time for this. I do have time for this. I, I literally don't do anything all day. And okay, give me the ending. You're so gullible. This is really fun, bro. If you really want the ending that bad, hold me for 100 seconds. 100 seconds fine that's that's not hard i would even hold this for an hour i don't care i'm literally not doing anything for the rest of the day I'm just gonna sit here and hold down the e key and that was so easy wow you're still here yeah i told you that was easy i have to say that's an impressive sign of patience okay you want the ending this bad go outside and scream villain arc then come back and i'll give you the ending i promise okay he's probably lying because Wait, what? Bro, are you serial? It's gonna take me 10 minutes to get outside and I haven't even opened the door yet. Get to it. Ugh. Okay, door number one is down. And then I bet I have to walk all the way back at this speed. Come on. Almost there. Okay, open. All right, good. Come on and... Bam. It just gets easier every morning. Okay, so at least I'm fast out here, but I have to yell villain arc. Wait, I think I spelled it wrong. Vil. Let me make sure I, I just spell both <laughs> just in case. Okay, going back in. Oh, I, I'm fast this time. All right. Wow, you actually did it. Lol. Yeah, that's right. Okay, okay. Here's the ending. Just hold it for five seconds this last time. Okay. If you're lying, I'm actually going to report the game right now, live. You know what? I'm actually not feeling it today. I'm going to just go back to bed. I'll help tomorrow morning. Ah, this is more like it. <laughs> the bad ending. Or villain ending. You decided to sleep in, helping nobody. Hope you're proud of yourself. I am. Let's check out my dad's kitchen here. So it's a piece of trash. There's not even a refrigerator. So I don't know what he's feeding me. And then we have a TV. We have like a safe thing. Can I like break the safe? Wait, I don't have my superpower. I have to go outside first. So now I have my superpowers. Let's go back inside. Hey, dad, uh, I'm just going to kind of try to blow up your safe here. <laughs> don't mind me, father. Just roasting it. Okay, I, I literally just blew myself up. Wait, is that does that count as an ending? I'm going to try it again, but I'm not going to stand as close to it. Dad, is your safe booby-trapped? Here, we got, we got to attack it from uh, far away this time. Am I hitting it? I can't tell. Okay, I blew it up, and I didn't die this time. Grab an old photo. Okay, what do I do with this photo? Do I give it to you? No. Do I have to complete all the quests again? Oh, I'll be right back. Just gonna fly through his window this time. Hey, kid! That's the way to do it. I just finished this quest and I can inspect water? Okay. Water? Why is there water near his window? Seems like it came from outside, too. Hmm. Is there something I do with the water? Oh, there's fur in his desk. Wait, what? Fur on his desk. A piece of cat fur? Last time I checked, he doesn't have a cat. So how did this fur get on his desk? The only cat in the neighborhood is muffins! Hmm, wait. Wait, so it was you this entire time. The car in a block of ice. Muffins stuck up in the tree. The guy's items scattered across the neighborhood. It was all me. Ha 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 Took you long enough to figure it out. Look how cool he looks. He's so giga chad with his anime hair and sunglasses. But why? Because it's fun. It isn't fun or funny. What makes you think I care? You're the only one who was nearly as strong as me. Buddy, you think you look strong? You're not even wearing a cape. You're just a cheap frickin' knockoff. No. No, no, that, that, that's not true. I'm the upgrade! I don't think so. Is this an anime ending? Is this what they do in anime? Oh! Ah! 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 Uh, you think you're strong? Uh, watch this. Uh, she got caught, Wait, I thought they're gonna have like an epic battle, so I was gonna do the sound effects. Well, I didn't finish that picture one, obviously, so I gotta go do that. So let's blow up the safe from a distance. Let's grab the photo. I think I bring it to him eventually, but not yet, unless it's like something I do after I help all the neighbors. Oh, I finally heated up his stupid coffee, so let's go fly back if see if the, the, I do something with the picture. What are you doing out here? Blah, blah, blah. Wait, this is different. The music's different. I told you, if I ever caught you again, just wait! Look, look what I found. Oh, is that, is that me and my mother? Oh, no, it's my dad and mother. Where did you find this? I might have blown up the safe. Father, are you okay? It's all my fault. Look at his face. Wait, what's your fault? How your mother died. I, I couldn't save her and it will haunt me for the rest of my days. Father, she wouldn't want you to be like this. She would want you to do the right thing. We might not be able to bring her back, but we can do what she would have wanted. My past rage and sorrow has blinded me. You're the only piece of her I have left. 
I love you, vitamin D, and I'm so sorry. It's okay, Papa. I love you, too. Ah! 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 Oh. Sad ending. You helped your dad come to terms with what happened to mother. <laughs> my dad's such a wuss. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, it's a lovely day in my car, and... Oh! Oh, my gosh. I'm out of gas. I didn't have any courteous auto burritos today. I'm kidding. They only make you sort of fart. Welcome to Gasville Population 9. Conveniently placed trophy shelf. Oh. What is this? I see you looking at me. Okay, let's uh, look away. All right, here we go. We have a home for sale. It's uh, $9 million. Objective, find gas. Okay. Well, hey, free gas legit. Totally won't destroy your car. All right. Thank you for the uh, the free gas, sir. Yo, you should use my free gas. I will. Here, give me that. Thank you. Can I buy your gas, please? How do I get it? Oh, pick up item. Okay. Hey, thank you very much. <laughs> Time to go use it. All right. Here we go. I'm a regular 89 car. So let's just fill it up with our free gasoline from the very nice uh, man at the, the booth. Over there. Wait, what? Oh, I just got the sc I got scammed. Oh my gosh, I got scammed. All right, let's try this again. So this game has 16 endings. That's the first one. And let's go talk to this uh, little bum here. Hey, what's up, man? Man, I'm starving. Can you give me some beans? I'll give you something in return. Yeah, uh, beans actually give you gas. So hold on, let me go uh, find a little store here. That's a dealership and that's Meme Street. So where do I get beans? Maybe I just go inside the, uh, these homes to steal. Here, give me some cash. If you left it outside, I'm gonna take it. Hello? I shouldn't be knocking there sleeping. Why are they sleeping during the day? Oh, she's floating in her bed. How does she do that? I don't know. Hey, excuse me. I found some money outside and I need beans. Oh, there's a ladder. All right. Hey, oh, what's this? $10? <laughs> Who leaves $10 in their backyard? What an idiot. Anyway, let's go up here. Note to sell. Fix roof so people stop breaking in. Okay. Oopsie. Okay, so that TV is destroyed. Uh, this clock is interesting. Oh, look. Oh, is this, do I have gas? Okay, here. Let's get out of here. Oh, I'm, I'm literally knocking on the door from the inside. Okay. Well, maybe uh, maybe I should just get out of here. I found gasoline. It's time to go fill up my car. Okay, this town sucks. No offense to everybody living here, but yeah, uh, I think I'm going to get out of here. I've got a girl to go see. All right, I'll see you later. That is the thief ending because I broke in and stole someone's gas. Is it really stealing if the house has already been broken into? That's the question that we got to ask ourselves. The TV was destroyed. The house was abandoned. I don't think that's stealing. So here's the two endings I got so far. Dude, this face is really triggering me. FYI, this game is going to be single player. Say single player lol. I don't remember asking. All right, so how do I get $9 million? JBM Love Soccer was here. Okay, nobody knows who that is. How much money is this? Some people keep leaving their money on, like, on the ground. That's kind of crazy. And there's nothing in the house. It's abandoned. Oh, but that's because it's for sale. Duh. All right, we got some uh, money on the ground by the gas station here. I'm just going to walk around and pick up a bunch of money. Look, here's some more. And this car looks good. How much is that one? I want that little car. Wait, guys, please stop breaking our windows. I can't lower the gas prices, man. Yeah, you know, these uh, last few years, gas has gotten really expensive. Oh, I can hear some music inside. Okay, well, you know what? Let's go inside. Talk to this guy. Hey, what's up? Oh, is this a gas can? Uh, yeah. Hey, I'm just going to borrow this. Um, yeah. Okay, see ya. Oh. Uh-oh. See? Oh! He just murdered me. Wait, is that an ending? Shoplift. You should not have done that. Okay, sorry. We got three of the 16 trophies. Let's get the $5 on the ground. No, I'm not going to get real gas. And then let's grab this money. And I really want this little car here. Hey, what's up, man? Yeah, I want to buy something from you. You're not even holding an item. Oh, okay. Well, I hear some really cool music. Wait, what's this? A trowel's $50. 88 gas is $75. And this one's $100. Okay. And then we have a reverse card. Okay, I'm going to take the reverse card. I would like to buy this, please. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to take the reverse card and we're going to reverse our gas situation. So let's uh, try it out here. <laughs> Fill it up with the uh, Uno reverse. Didn't you know it works? Oh, uh, yeah. Wait, what? Uh, how am I going to get home now? Don't worry about it. Oh, that is the no you ending. Running out of gas sure sucks. All right, so we have four endings. Let's try to get $50. Just going to check behind every... Oh, you know what? I think this is what we dig with the trowel. Here, give me that. Give me that. Made you look. Okay. So we need $50 in order to actually dig that. And I don't know what to do with the tickets. Oh, it's just $1. Okay. All right. Give me that money. Was there any money in the broken house? I don't remember. But we haven't been to Meme Street yet. So let's go over here. Oh, we have some beans. Oh, hello, kitty. Okay, I can't get it. Oh, look. <gasps> Wait, what? Look how long it's going to take me to pick up $99,999. You got to be kidding me. Okay, I'll, I'll be right back. Will I actually get kicked for being AFK before picking this up? Oh my gosh, my finger's hurting. Please. It's almost done. Just slowly getting to the end. And watch it kick me. It's super glued to the ground. Bro! I broke my finger for that. What's this? T-posing for money. Okay. Mine now. What's this say? Find gas for your car. Duh. Single Bob sad. Okay, here, more money. What's this? Bank of Gasville. Can I rob it? Take their money. Oh. 
Okay, I see money down here. Don't be sad. I'm just gonna take this $10. Where does the sewage go? Where do these notes come? Does this kill me? Oh, rip to this guy. Uh, you have money, sir? Can I take your money? No. Oh, a crawl through pipe. Oh, Rathfill, population four. Hey, guys, you have money? I can get a home for sale. 10,000 cheeses? Well, how do I get cheese? Oh, your car ran out of gas? I'm so sorry. Free cheese? Here, give it to me. No? Okay. Really cute. Here, let's go in the plumber pipe. Hello? What do I do now? Uh, where's the pipe? Hello? Oh my gosh, I got the back rooms ending. Okay, but seriously, my finger hurts from holding down the E key so long. Wait, what if I try to refill it with nothing in my hand? Is that an ending? Let's find out. Oh, oh no, nothing. Okay. Can I just break in here? Come on, let me in. All right, give me this money on the floor. You guys don't need it. And can I uh, buy this Lambo? Hello? No? Okay, well, uh, what do you have for sale? So it's $200 for that car. This one's sold. Hey, what's up, man? Would like to buy a car. You're too broke. Dude, shut up. Do you have money back here that I can steal? Uh, I don't see anything to steal. All right, I'll be back with uh, $200. Actually, I want to get the little shovel and dig this up. So let's actually do that. You have to wander around and find it. Wait, what's this say? Fake Lamborghini to make people think I'm cool. Car dealer. True. It's probably one of the dumbest investments you could ever make. Hey, what's this down here? Oh, that's just a guy. All right, I'm back, Meme Town. You're just to steal your money, okay? No, shut up. Oh, look, gas. For gas, ignore the cage. Uh-uh. I'm committed to... Ooh, lemonade! Okay, hold on. Just want to do one ending at a time. Okay, what's this? I see more money. Okay, another $10. Is this like a bank truck? Roblox server van. Back to the shady drive here. And an another $5. Okay. Hey, what's this? Oh! Hey, can I bonk someone with this? Hello? Do I use this to break in? What is this? Bank of Gasville? Okay, uh, open please. Hello? Oh, right here. Look, I can bash the wall. Okay, so break the wall. Uh, okay, give me this. Thank you. And I'm gonna run to my car. We're getting out of here. Oh my gosh, I only have 50 seconds. Please, please. It's, it wasn't me. No, no, stay there, kitty. It's just gasoline. Don't worry about it. No, uh, don't mind me. I, I, I paid for this, I promise. Totally legitimate gas. Good thing this town doesn't have any police. <laughs> it's such a piece of crap town. Oh, yeah, we got the highest ending. Okay, this time I'm actually gonna do the uh, the shovel ending, or I'm gonna try. I just keep getting distracted, okay? Hold on. Give, so, give me the money here. We got $11, and we got $5 here. Hey, shut up. The heck song is that? Another uh, $10. Or, okay, we only need like $11. Here, I'm gonna take your $1. Thank you. I'm now at $40. Then we got uh, $5 here. Okay, so I just need like $5 or $10. I think it was $55. So, give me that. And give me a couple of these. <laughs> Some dollar dollar. And can I steal money from you? Oh, he has money here. Okay, we have $62. I know that's enough. All right, let's go back. Ooh, some money back here. Good. And some more money over here. We have 69 sussy dollars. All right, we're going to buy this thing. So this is $5. Hello, sir. I would like to buy this. Thank you very much. Now let's head back to uh, behind the car dealer. Hey, uh, Mr. Dealer, don't mind me. I'm just, uh, just doing some construction work back here. So let's dig up this hole. And ooh, a treasure chest. Well, what could this be? <gasps> oh my gosh, what is this? <gasps> A gold bar. Wait, what do I do with this this block thing? It's like glitched. Where do we put this? Did I miss something? Can I sell this to you? Here, do you want this? You're too broke. Okay, so I don't have to, uh, my $200 uh, yet. But if I walk around and gather all the money, I bet I can get it. Or maybe I sell this. What about this? Here, I'm going to take your money first. And now I'm going to talk to you. You should use my free... Okay, so he doesn't want this block. What about you? Do you want the block? Um, he says I already own it. Okay, what well, can I tip it to him? Would you like to buy a donation? No, developer can suffer. Trash can. I don't want to throw this away. Oh my gosh, what do I do with this thing? What about this homeless guy? Hey, do you want this like glitched? block i have oh no he wants beans what about you can i just knock on your door wake you up okay well uh she's floating in bed still uh okay oh there's the beans right here i don't know what to do with this glitch block do you want this block mr sewer man it says my eyes burn okay well that <laughs> sucks to be you get it uh you on my shirt okay never mind gasville arcade uh okay can i use this in here limited time wind gas okay well let me in please hello i can climb it okay well, I don't know how to go in. But if I just walk away with this block, can I do that? Let's uh, interact with the tunnel. And okay, I, I just walked. That's another ending. Let's see if we can find out. Let's see if we can find out what to do with that block. Uh, nothing here says anything about that. So maybe it's like the secret ending here. All right, let's go get this homeless guy uh, his beans. I saw them over here by a tree. Oh, there they are. Wait, they're not here anymore. Okay, well, in that case, I'm just going to grab the free gas because it's just free. Oh, no. And that is the trapped ending. Trapped in a cage of my own pain. All right, let's look for the beans. I'm guessing they actually randomly spawn. Yeah, don't worry, homeless man. I will find the beans. 
and you will fart. So I first saw them over here, but now they're not here. Hello, beans. Where art thou? Here, give me that money. If I can't find the beans, then we'll just do uh, the lemonade. We'll, we'll go buy some lemonade. Oh, it's a taxi. Hey, what's up, man? Pay $50 to ride. Okay, I'll be right back. Let me go get some money. And by get, I mean steal. Guess okay, grab these ones. Grab this money back here. That's $10. Really nice. And then we'll get the money in the back. Can now afford the taxi. Hey, Mr. Taxi Driver. Yeah, get me out of this town. It's, it's really trash. I'm sick of it. Oh, finally. Yeah, who cares about my car? They can keep it. Taxi ending. All right, let's look for the beans again. And actually, I, I never actually went to here yet. So let's try this. Okay. Here, give me that. Thank you. Bye. Hello, beans. Where the heck are you? Dude, why is it not spawning anymore? Well, I can't seem to find the beans, so I'm going to go buy the gas container. Hey, do I, do I even have enough for it? $75. Okay, let's get this one. Hello, sir. I would like to buy this tank of gas. Thank you. Well, the container is brown, so I don't know how this is going to do. So let's fill this up and let's see what happens. All right. Well, I guess we got wrong gas. Nothing happened. It's just, nope, wrong. No worries. We move on with our life. Wait, maybe I have to talk to him first and then the beans spawn. Maybe I'm just actually that stupid. Okay. Did it spawn? Oh, yep. You know what? So I'm just dumb. You have to uh, talk to the guy and then the beans spawn. Sometimes I'm just actually too smart. All right, here we go. Enjoy your beans, good sir. Hey, thanks. Well, you had gas with you the whole time? That's just crazy. You should have stolen a car from the dealership after they closed. All right, thanks, homeless man. I'm going to get out of this stupid city. Wait, what? Oh, he's such a good guy. The good guy ending. All right, let's go get some lemonade. I'm thirsty. Hey, man. Yeah, I'd like to buy some lemonade. I heard it's actually a really good fuel source. All right, yeah, thank you. Just going to take this lemonade and fill her up. Every last drop. Ah, there we go. Okay. Well... Do not put lemonade into your vehicles. Oh, look. So the car says I'm a regular 89 car. So that brown gas tank was actually the 88. That's why it did not work. So we need $100. And I think the only way to get $100 is to buy the shovel and then open the chest. So I have to walk around and get $50. This is crazy. Wait, what if I use that uh, glitch cube on this car somehow? I guess I'll give it a try. But first, I need my shovel. Give it to me, please. Thank you. Let's dig up the dirt and give me my chest treasure. Oh uh, yeah, $157. All right, but first I'm going to try to put this into the server van because maybe this is like a server piece. Hello? Can this go in? Is this like go in here? Hello? You guys take these uh, little cubes? No? Okay. Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. Hey man, do you want it? No, I guess he doesn't take the cube either. Well, I don't know what to do with this thing, so I'm going to throw it away. Yeah, you get in there. No one likes you. Let's take the regular 89 gas and let's buy it. And okay, so now I should be able to actually leave. Get out of this crummy city forever. All right, let's fill her up. Oh, yeah. So that is just the basic ending. Oh, the store ending. Okay, there's a plumber ending. It says it's in the sewer. So let's go back to the sewer. Play with all of my rat friends. Hello, friends. So I think last time I went in this one. Let's try this one. Oh, oh. Okay, this seems oddly familiar. That's okay. We're gonna make it through alive. Oh no. Ah! Watch out. Okay. Ah! Okay, uh, this is kind of scary. I can't see the bottom here. Oh boy. Ah! Okay, walk, walk. Okay, uh, we're walking. Get my mouse out of the way. It's distracting. And. Wait, is that it? Okay, that's it. Plumber ending. Awesome. Okay, we only have four more endings. See, the van, I'm supposed to destroy it. I have no idea how to do that. And then we have pointless. This really wasn't a good move. Involves a car dealership. Does that mean I have to, like, try to steal the car? Let's see. Okay, let's just walk up to the car. Hey, shut up, idiot. Just here to take the car, please. No, I can't. Okay, maybe I actually need $200. I don't think I can get $200. There's the other ending with uh, the person in this house. So maybe if I just keep knocking over and over again, she'll come out. No, I don't care if they're sleeping. Wake up. I really shouldn't be asked. See, so she's gonna get mad and get out of bed. Oh, oh, you woke me up. I'm sorry. Okay, the tenant ending. All right, let's try to get $200 and buy the car. So I'm gonna walk around and collect every single dollar bill I see. There is money on the roof that I did not know about. So that does change things. Maybe I can actually get $200 and then I buy the shovel and I can dig up the gold. I don't know, something like that. So I need like seven more dollars. Oh, here's two more. Okay, now I just need $5. Where am I missing a $5? Hello? Oh boy, I found it. Okay, so this gives me $100. And now when I dig up the gold, it'll, it'll bring me to exactly $200. And then we can go buy a car and get out of here. Hello, sir. I'd like the shovel. Thank you. And let's dig up the treasure. And there's the gold bar. I don't care about that glitch thing. I don't know what, what it is. All right, sir. I have exactly $200. Wait, yes. I would like to buy a car. Oh, your keys are on the counter. Okay. It says my car's... <gasps> there it is. Oh my gosh. Yes, let me in. Get me out of this stupid town. I've been here for way too long. 
Oh yeah, listen to that engine rumble. All right, let me in. Come on. Oh, there I go. Yeah, the pointless ending. That wasn't pointless. All right, now we have the van ending and then the secret ending. I don't... Wait, what? Let's try to do the van ending. So we got to get creative here. It's a van. Maybe we have to just blow up the van. Only thing I can think of is grabbing whatever this thing is, this little hammer, and then maybe we can bash it. We tried putting that cube in it. It didn't do anything. And here, give me the money. Okay, here we go. Destroy the van. Okay. Yeah, I got kicked. All right, we got the van ending. The only ending I have is the secret ending. Oh boy, I am Sam. And it's time to... Oh, come on, Billy. Reconsider this. Wait, what, what did Billy do? No, Sam. Kevin got me in trouble at school today. He has to pay. Billy, you stuck gum in his hair. You had it coming. What? I had to put my gum somewhere. Wait, which one's Billy? Just help me egg his house, okay? Let's give him a dot, 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 because that's always funny. Nothing to say, huh? Fine. But I'm still doing it. Uh oh. Wait, did he just do it? Oh. Did this kid... Oh. Okay, so he throws really fast. I'm going to check my mail. Wait. What am I supposed to do? Hey... Let me just block him. Oh. <gasps> oh. Uh, Billy. What What did you just do? Just run. That's actually a good idea. Oh, he dropped gum. Oh, crap. So, we just burned down. Is this Kevin right here? Uh-oh. <gasps> Kevin. Oh. Sorry, Kevin. We uh, murdered your sister. Well, I didn't do anything. Just going to point that out. Whoa. VNN? House goes up in flames. Breaking news. We're live on the scene where a small home here in Bloxville has went up in flames. We've got word that the body of one woman has been recovered from the house. Okay, so we are murderers. Her identity is unknown at this moment. The cause of the fire is currently unknown, but an investigation will be launched after the fire has been put out. Truly a tragic event. Okay, so we killed Kevin's sister or mom. Oh, 20 years later, night one. Wait, what? Hello? Oh. It's really dark, but this kid's got tattoos. Oh, yeah, he's got tattoos. Man, that fire really did a number on this house. Yeah, it's a shame they never found out what caused the fire. Sam just says nothing. Billy says nothing. Anyways, let's scope out the scene. I'm still distraught. I can't believe you convinced me to join you in this. What? You don't want to make it big on blocks, tube? Do you have any idea how much views channels that explore abandoned places get? We can film here all we'd like, fake all the stuff we want, and all the morons who view it will eat it up. Okay, this developer has issue with uh, YouTubers. You're just jealous, bro. You're right. We can make it big doing this. Yeah, Sam. I'm always right. Whatever. Let's get on with it, says the murderer. Oh, so the door survived? All right. Well, here we are. Whoa. Is this game like... Is this just a movie, not a game? Look at this place. I'm sold. This is the perfect place for our videos. Is this going to be like a haunted house, actually? I'm with you on that. This is going to be awesome, says Steven. No one knows who he is, even though he's got headphones on and wearing sunglasses at night. I don't know, guys. I think I want to take a look around first. Whatever. Just meet us outside when you're done and don't take too long. Wait. They're, they're waiting outside for me? Oh. Okay, so I'm just going to look around by myself. Okay. Um, all right, so we got a house. This house supposedly burned down, even though the refrigerator, I don't know what that is. We got some broken windows. And um, a smiley. What am I looking for? Just anything, right? I'm just clicking. Fun dungeon. Oh, let's enter. What? Why is this labeled the fun dungeon? You suddenly feel very uneasy. Leave this house. No, I don't listen to anyone but myself. So I'm going to stay. I'm going to go in here. What's this? Can I jump on the bed? So the bed survived. Um, okay. Well, I don't think there's anything else for me to find. Can I go in the fun dungeon, please? Hello? I'm trying to open up these cabinets. Okay, I have no choice. I guess I'll leave because I want to, not because the developer wants me to. It's, I'm doing it because I want to. Hello, idiots. So, what do you think? I like it. This was a great place to pick. Glad we could all come to an agreement. Then it's settled. This will be our filming location. Steven, remember to bring your camera tomorrow. We'll all meet here tomorrow night at this time for our first video. 
So they're gonna learn that YouTube isn't as easy as they think it is. Later that night, must know what's in basement. Why are you dreaming about that? Billy, Steven, what's in the basement? Am I in a dream right now? I think I'm dreaming. Can I leave, please? Wake me up. I cannot wake up, so I'm just going to go straight to the fun dungeon. Because it says fun, that means it must be really fun. Here we go, kids. Into the fun dungeon. Hmm. Maybe this isn't a good idea. Okay, I'm gonna get pulled in. Yep, that was the most obvious thing ever. <laughs> I just know that because I play a lot of horror games. Go to my other channel and you'll see the really fun horror games. Oh, there's a sword. Oh. I'll feel safer with this knife. Night number two. Wait, so what do we do during... Oh, okay, I'm done. Well, tonight is the night. Ready, Steven? Yup. Let's get this show on the road. Sam, I'm ready to stab whatever's in the fun dungeon. Yep, let's do this. Awesome. Glad to hear you're on board with us. Now, let's head inside. I agree, that's a good idea. Okay, I'll stand over here and deliver an opening for the video. Sam, go find something to make some noise with. I think we can convince people that this place is haunted. After you hear me mention the dead occupants of the house, Make the noise. Okay, that's really stupid. You would do that in post-production. Stupid idiot has no idea how to be a YouTuber. Freaking moron. All right, let's find something to break. Can I break the wall? Oh, should I pound on this wall to produce a sound? Yes, this should work. Hello, internet. Tonight we're in an abandoned house that burned down due to... Oh, wait, this is not how YouTubers talk. <laughs> Hello, internet! <laughs> Rumor has it that the ghost of a mother and son haunt this very place. In fact, I've hit... Whoa! Uh, uh, as you can see, the spirits aren't happy with our presence. So we'll leave it off here for tonight and return tomorrow. Don't forget to like and sub. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, that video was 38 seconds. Was so he making a short? Those are cringe. Well, I'd say that was a successful first night. Great work. I'm just going to encourage Sam for everything because he's clearly a murdering narcissist. Steven, it's not that hard to pound on a wall. Still, Billy, Sam deserves credit. Anyways, let's bounce. Uh, let's all meet here tomorrow night at the same time. Yeah, they're all coming here to film a 30 second short. I think I'll show up a bit earlier than you two. I've got some stuff I'd like to set up. Sounds good. All right, so we're going back home. Night number three, it's bloody red. So what do you think Steven wanted to set up? No clue. He probably just wanted to set up more cameras or something. Oh, did you see how many views our video got? Wait, you already uh, posted it? Uh, no, I didn't tell me. No, how many did we get? Get this, we got over 3,000 views. That's actually really good for your first video. We're gonna make so much money off this. Anyways, let's not keep Steven waiting. Guy thinks he's so cool. Steven, where is he? Ugh, he better not have chickened out. We need him if this is going to work. No, you don't. You just need a phone. Surely he's here somewhere. So we just got to agree with uh, just, you know, let him run the show. He wouldn't have canceled without telling us, right? He's got to be here somewhere. He's probably murdered. Yeah, let's see if we can find him. Or maybe he's in the fun dungeon. All right, let's go find Steven. Just going to go straight to the fun dungeon because I just really want to go down there. Like, that's all. I just want to... Wait, hello? Dude, I can't go in the fun dungeon. Swag. This is what kids write on the wall. Well, he's really not here. Unless... Yeah, here we go. To the fun dungeon. This is the only reason I came back here at night three. You don't think you'd go down there, do you? There's only one way to find out. Uh, Did I, did I bring my knife? Hello? Hello? Steven? Are you down here? Steven! Quit messing with us. Get out where we can see you. Billy, I don't like this. Let's just get out of here and call the police. See, so he, Billy's gonna get mad because I started to try to tell him what to do. No, Sam, we'll find him ourselves. Let's check out the rooms down here. Maybe he's in one of them. Yeah, so Billy's a typical narcissist. It's his way or the highway. Look for any clues as to where Steven went. 
so yeah with people like billy you just um you just be a, you just go okay billy that sounds cool and then you run away They're like yeah billy that's awesome oh my gosh you're so smart okay and uh, never talk to me again bye oh look pick up steven's headphones are these steven's headphones <gasps> put them on see what kind of music he's listening. okay you know what i think billy stabbed me actually if I, I think I saw some tattoos, so everything I've said is correct. But Billy, what's going on? Wait, he's tied up too. Oh, good. You're finally awake. Don't worry about him. He's knocked out. He can't hear you. Who are you? Allow me to reintroduce myself, Sam. Oh, reintroduce. Oh, it's Kevin. So, Sam, do you remember me now? Kevin? Is, is that you? Yes, Sam. It's me, Kevin. I apologize for what I had to do just now. Billy and I have some unfinished business, and I couldn't let you get in the way. Anyways, I'm getting impatient. Let's wake up our good friend, Billy. Bam, yeah. But what? What's going on? Wait. Kevin, how are you alive? Why am I tied up? You probably thought I died in the fire, didn't you? I wasn't home at the time. I missed the bus, so I had to walk home. My poor mother, however, was home and was trapped inside. She didn't make it out. This photo is all I have left to remember. <laughs> okay, sorry. Anyways, we have a lot to talk about. What? Do you remember when you burned my house down? What? You, you have no proof that, uh, that I did that? I don't like liars, Billy. Does this pack of gum look familiar? I found it right outside of my house on the day of the fire. I... Hi! You don't have to say anything. Nothing you say or do will get you out of this. Please, Kevin. It, it was an accident. I never meant for this to happen. It doesn't matter. What you did ruined my life. I couldn't save my mother. I rushed in to try to help her, but the heat was too much. It's how I got this horrible burn on my face. Oh, I thought that was his hair. She was the only person I had in my life, and you took her away from me. I never got over her death, so I spent the last 20 years living in this basement figuring out how i could track you down and get my revenge it finally paid off though you were foolish enough to come here yourself and now justice can finally be served who what, what are you gonna do to us you're going to share the same fate as my mother i'm going to set this place on fire and you're going to burn alive Come on, Kevin. <laughs> you gotta think about this. <laughs> Do you really want to kill us? I've had 20 years to think about this, Billy. Karma has finally caught up with you. Oh. Goodbye, Billy. Goodbye, Sam. I wish it didn't have to be this way. Bam. Oh, no. Gasoline. Sam, we have to get out of here. Um, okay. Good thing I brought my knife. That's right. <laughs> Let's cut it. Oh, yeah. Cut through the rope. Can you cut any slower, bro? There we go. Sam, get me out of here. All right, so you're a narcissist. I'm going to leave you because you're a bad person. So goodbye, bro. You left Billy to die. That's right, I did. He's a loser. There goes Kevin. Kevin! It's over, Sam. I got my revenge on Billy. This can end here. You'll never have to see me again. Uh, yeah, you can go. <laughs> you, you killed the narcissist. It's okay. Just get out of here. Hmm. All right, well, that's one less psychopath in the world. Why did any of this have to happen? Oh. Uh-oh. Wait, am I going to get arrested? Hello? Team Kevin Award. We don't know what happened to Steven. All right, so we got the Team Kevin ending. And so let's get some other endings here. I can skip the dialogue by clicking the text. That's really nice. This time I'm going to click, no way, I'm not helping you. Wait, did I click that before? I don't know, but look, over here, I got to uh, grab this rock. And then I'm just going to throw it at him. Ow! Sam, what the heck was that for? You weren't listening, Billy. You have to stop. You just hit me with the rock, Sam. You could have seriously hurt me. I'm going home. Okay, so we prevented him from throwing the rock into the window and killing Kevin's mother. And the candle's still there. And why would you put a candle in the window? It'll just get blown out by the wind. Oh, here comes uh, Kevin. Ah, 
Home sweet home. Inside he goes. And we got the inadvertent hero award. So that's the second ending. Everyone's alive. The mother doesn't die. Life goes on. Billy probably doesn't turn into a narcissist because he's not a murderer. All right, next ending. Come on. This time we're going to get the, uh, the the question mark ending. So to do that, we're going to help him. Fine, I'll help. Glad you came to your senses. Now take these eggs. But instead of throwing the eggs at the house, I'm just going to throw them at this little bird here. Wait, am I failing? Hello? Okay, so there he goes. We need to get whatever this thing is. Fragment collected one of five. Uh-oh. So, uh, the narcissist kills Kevin's mother. Billy, what did you just do? Okay, come on. Let me skip. He drops the gum. By the way, how did Kevin figure out that's Billy's gum? Did he get it DNA tested? I was kind of wondering that. Yeah, your mom's dead. All right, night number one, 20 years later. I'm in the haunted house, and I got to explore... We got to get uh, the second key fragment. Ugh, come on. That's, I just saw it. Okay, hold on. There we go. Pick up a fragment. Two of five collected. And now let's pound on the fun dungeon. All right, now I'm having this like crazy dream. And this ending's like really, really, uh, yeah, I don't know how people actually figure this out. I have to pick up this pipe. Hello? Pick it up. Thank you. And then I have to break a window somewhere. Is it here? Yeah. So break that one. Sneak out. And... It's like out here somewhere. Where is it? Here it is. Thank you. Three of five. I think I have to go back inside. Hello. And then we go to the fun dungeon. Why would you turn around like that? Oh, stupid kid. All right. Night number two. I head inside. Where's the TV? It's over here. And back here is fragment number four. And now we just got to get to night number three in the basement. Oh, wait. This is where the uh, the headphones are. There they are. Okay. Come on, Kevin. Get on with it. Yeah. Kill him, Kevin. Yeah. Okay. So now I have to cut through the rope. Oh, yeah. But it takes forever because I'm weak. And uh, I got to find the last fragment. I think it's over here. There it is. So I got five of five. I walk through the fire and I cut Billy free. Now let's get out of here. Oh, Kevin, you're not escaping. You two couldn't just die, could you? You couldn't have just let justice be served. Maybe I didn't get my revenge tonight, but mark my words. One day justice will be served and you'll both be dead. Now I want to let him go because I'm not a murderer. Just get out of here. Hmm. He runs off. Why did any of this have to happen? Sam, how could you just let him go? Look at this freaking murderer. I couldn't bring myself to hurt him. He was our friend. Okay, so that is the, the pacifist and the question mark award. So we got two endings. Ooh. Is this a key or bones? It's a key. And the key magically goes into this door. And let's, oh, oh, is that, um, I already forgot his name, Steven. I think that's Steven. To be continued. So we actually got two endings, uh, in one. Steven remains trapped in the basement. <laughs> okay, on to the next ending. Come on. Okay, let's be a girl this time. We're going to try to kill everybody. First things first, we're going to help. Whip out the egg and throw it at the candle because, you know, we want to, uh, set the house on fire. Come on, just got to get a jump attack. Ooh, that one was close. Bro, how am I missing that candle? Oh. Oh, no. So, Billy is always the murderer. Goodbye, mother. Okay, now I have to skip all the way to the basement. Cringe. Oh, my gosh. Finally made it down here. Okay. So, it's really important that we pick up Steven's headphones, which are right here. And then now, I run my auto clicker to help me skip all this text. Come on, auto clicker. Thank you so much. I once again have to cut through the rope. And I'm going to say goodbye to Billy. You're an idiot. And I'm going to head up the stairs. So I leave Billy to die. And now I'm going to kill Kevin. He doesn't deserve to live. So, uh, yeah, kill Kevin. I'm sorry, Kevin. But I can't let you get away with what you just did. So, uh, oh, we throw it. Oh, right through his nose. That is an amazing shot. Why did any of this have to happen? Popo's coming. Completed in 831. That's the Warmonger Award. Everyone is pretty much dead. We don't know where Steven is. Bro, I missed the speedrunner by one second. Oh my gosh, 831. What a joke. That's so annoying. I'll do that later. Let's do the rescued ending now. All right, let's go with the, uh, the girl again. This time, we're not going to help Billy, so no way. And now I got to skip all the way to the basement. Uh, I'm going to try to speedrun, actually. Finally made it to the basement. Let's pick up the headphones. Very important. And now the auto clicker is just running constantly. Oh, come on, come on. I might even get the speed run here. But we have to listen to this idiot talk for 10 minutes. All right, come on, Kevin. 
Thank you. So now all I got to do is uh, just do nothing. I cut myself free. And then I just kind of walk around and uh, explore, have a good time. I think Steven's in here. It's like boarded up. Okay, well, maybe he's in here. I don't know. Oh. Okay, so I just get consumed. Oh. I hear beeping. I'm in the hospital. Oh. <gasps> Huh? I'm alive? I look perfect. Oh, good. You're finally awake. Wait, is this Kevin? Oh, no. It's just a nurse. Nurse Adams. Hi, I'm Nurse Adams. Oh, my auto clicker's running. Sorry. One of your friends dropped you off here last night. You said you were in need of immediate medical attention or something about fire. Billy? What's his name? Billy? He didn't say. He dropped you off. All we know about him was that he had this really bad burn mark. Oh, that's Kevin. Anyway, you don't seem to have any significant injuries. Okay, you know what? I want to get the speed run. So, yeah. Oh, we have a, a recording to listen to. Hello, Sam. If you're hearing this, it means you've woken up in the hospital. As you've probably already figured out, I'm the one who brought you there. It wouldn't have been fair to let you die to something Billy caused. Speaking of him, he's done. Burnt to a crisp. As for your other friend, I'm not sure where he is now. I left him in one of the rooms in the basement, but chances are he's dead by now as well. Anyways, this will be the last time you ever hear from me. You won't ever see me again, and I suggest not looking for me either. I did what I had to do. Now let me live out the rest of my life fulfilled. The monster who killed my mother is gone. Goodbye, Sam. I wonder if the police listen to that. 813, baby. Got the, the rescued award and the speedrunner award. Two in one. <laughs> All right. Now I'm going to do the perished ending. It's literally the same ending as the last one, except in the beginning here, I help him egg the house. So let's help him. Yeah, die, Kevin's mom. <laughs> we're going to kill you. That's what we're here. We're actually, we're going to murder you. Kevin's mom, we're murdering you. We are murderers. Guys, this video is taking me hours. Please subscribe. So I cut through the rope and then I just uh, take too long down here. I play in the fire. Hey, don't worry, Billy. I'm gonna help you free, uh, get free, okay? Just hold. Oh. Crap. Sorry, Billy. I was too slow. Seven minutes. That was really fast. I'm getting good. So Sam died. Billy died. Kevin lived. Stupid Billy. Welcome to Free Disease.